Hi. Hey, don't walk back. Hey, don't chat. Uh, we're back to Grim Fandango. I'm gonna finish it today, I think, probably. Um, how you doing? Welcome. How's everyone doing on this day of the year? Um, it's not Dia de los Muertos anymore, but it's fine. We're gonna finish it. Hope everyone has having a good one. Uh, well, hello. Hey, Blobsy. Hello. We're, yeah, we are on the start of year three. Um, we're on a boat, and I'll get you caught up in case you're like, what the hell's going on? Uh, but yeah, welcome back. Uh, before we hop into the game, though, uh, I did want to, uh, briefly, briefly, um, enjoy some, uh, Dongtober stylings. For those that don't know, uh, here, here on this corner of the internet, we, every October, for a couple years now, celebrate the most fantabulous time of year, which is, of course, Dongtober, wherein we celebrate, um, everyone's favorite, the, the Nintendo ape. Um, and so I, I took a minute to quickly, uh, grab, it's not a, a completely cohesive list. I didn't grab every single piece of art submitted to the Dongtober chat on the Discord server that we have, but I, I, I grabbed a handful. Nice. Thought we'd take a moment to quickly enjoy what people have been up to last month before we dive back into Grim Vandango. Uh, but thank you. Um, so without further ado, let's just, let's just get right in the hell into there. Um, I'm actually gonna replace the music with, um, two people made music this year, uh, which I was not expecting. The, um, for a little bit, I'm gonna play, uh, the Tong, the Dongtober Orchestra as rendered by the cast 48. So, I'll let that play in the background as we quickly journey down into Dongtober Lane. Um, Jesus Christ. This is off to a terrible start. Um, Cave Monster started literally the, like, seconds after Gam unarchived the channel with this nonsense. Um, Chat rejoices at the Dongtober its approach. It's a nightmare. Um, thanks for that. Uh, Elliot the Bog submitted over the Gardong wall. Uh, Ludlime with a very inspirational Dong poster. Hunter Ganzi, uh, enough said. Um, Pangolin Montanari, uh, enough said. Moirai, it's very good. Excellent. There was a theme this year. I mean, there's a theme every year, um, but it's always meant to be a suggestion. If you draw Donkey Kong, you're celebrating Dongtober. Uh, the theme this year was was uh, Dong Donkey Kong on vacation or like traveling somewhere. So a lot of those are inspired by that, but not all of them. The Dong piece is real. Um, Killy, <laughs> oh, I can't make it bigger, but you get the idea. Killy went to, um, what is it? I, I forgot the name of the planet. Whatever. LV48. Well, that's the first movie. I don't remember what the second movie. Whatever. Is it the same? Whatever. Uh, it's fine. Um, BB posted this really good Sonic Dong. Uh, <laughs> Isaac Startown posted Donkey Kong culturally appropriating in the shade in Mario Odyssey and Tostarena. Um, for one of my personal favorites. Well done, Isaac. Um, the Mario is very inspired. Uh, General Isaku, where we drop him, boys. Out of uh, Funky Kong's Funky Flights, uh, Shoen added Donkey Kong to what I'm assuming is the Balloons game. There he is, Dark Volt. Dark Volt just like did like a character study. They're gonna show up a bunch through this. Um, Jesus, oh my God, the voices. Um, uh, Jordan, absolutely stunning work. <laughs> Can we get much higher? Uh, go work, uh, Duke Nuke. Made a comic about me selling a timeshare to Donkey Kong for some reason. Uh, it's better than a vacation. You actually own a piece of land. Well, that's the reason why. Um, well, one third of a place with three other people. But I mean, look at this place. It's a dream. I have already sold timeshares to a flaming screaming skull, a skinless ghost, and Logan Paul. How about it, DK? Ready to own your vacation? That's better than going on vacation is owning your vacation. Donkey Kong? Come on. All right. Well, that was that was the orchestra by the cast. And then also, um, White Hawk... Uh, uh, did, um, indeed, uh, I'll just play it. I think is maybe better than talking about it. Here, here, here we go. DK 
Yeah, it's um. Thank you, Whitehawk. Um, okay. Uh, Zin and Wintry Sage provided none thoughts 87 banan. To which Zen then said no thoughts allowed. And changed the sign from Kong's Banana Horde to Kong's Banana Star. I don't know. Listen, uh, Darkfold with another pensive Donkey Kong. Uh, BB with a second. Very good. I think they said average. Average Dongtober enjoyer, which is very good. I'm losing my mind. Quasars, AI generated this. There are a couple AI generated ones, which are very good. Why does this work? Why does this work? I don't know. Um, it's very upsetting. Thank you. Dark Vault again. He's staring in your soul. Obtuse. You know him. Well, Bravo. Bravo. Amajima Diddy's inspired. Where is on I know I need to send this there. Make sure she sees it. He shoots, yeah. it's, it's gonna hurt. hurt. Uh Nian Bro. Very inspired. Thank you. Um Donkey Chan! Uh and also this was Nian Bro. A good a good donkey pog. This is very good. Uh, uh, Dark Vault, I'm not sure what their inspiration was behind this piece. I can't say I, I this is what I detest. Thank you. Um, loading, I despise this as well. This does not spark joy. I'm sure it's fine. Um, uh, Omar Mustard sent Donkey Kong to uh, Perry. He's eating what appears to be a croissant instead of a banana. I don't know what Puppet Bear is doing, he's fine. Uh, Ikisoba just made a literal piece of art, apparently. Also, we're just gonna loop this till we're done here. So that's just... Holy shit. I'm assuming, so like, I know people were posting in Donktober art that they did not in themselves make. Um, so, but I'm, I, 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 I'm assuming that they made this. It's amazing. Uh, Hork posted Weekend of Donkeys. Which is very good. Very, very good. He's fine. He's okay. Don't worry about him. Uh, Fizzy Gert, meanwhile. This bullshit. What the what the hell is happening? It's good. Uh, Thick Room found this in the wild and then edited it to say Dong Editor. So that's good. Hey, thank you. Welcome back. Uh, Dark Vault. <laughs> this one might be my favorite of the ones they made. This one's real good. Um, uh, oh, th this, this, yeah. This was posted by Less Complicated Name. Dong Energy is an integrated energy company based in Fredericia, Denmark. Dong has since expanded its productivity. It's good. Welcome back. Hey. Uh, cave. How fitting for for the it's Donkey Kong in Splatoon. He's Team Big Man, of course he is. He's got taste. It's very good. Um, General Isaku has a bunch. The Cranky Kong is my favorite here. He's having a terrible time, but they're doing a Donkey Kong. Uh, Silent Shadow. Donkey Kong's hanging out on a cruise ship. Nice. Really good. Guy wearing only a guy wearing only shorts posted Dong in Abyss. Which is bad. Uh Chug him the puppet. I'm just gonna leave this up for a minute. He, he, he's drinking that soup! That Dong Topo 22 2022 special. None thoughts A7 banana. Um I need to grab this real quick because it's desktop live paper. Do it now because the Donktober channel on the server is probably going to be put into the archive pretty soon. Next couple DK. days. Soup. DK. Soup. It's some good DK. soup. Thank you for the soup. And thank Jugum the Puppet for the soup because that's insane. Um, Penguin Montanari. I forget. This was in context of some conversation that was happening about whether or not Donktober was real. I think. So like, no, clearly it's real. 
The dong is real. Onsta? Hey, Onsta, you probably just got here, so I need to back up for a minute. Um, let me make sure you see this one specifically. Uh, this one. There's there's two that Onsta needs to see. Actually, three. Yeah. Oh! Yeah, yeah, that's good. This was by Obtuse. Yeah, no, it's good. It's actually really, really good. Dongtober was blessed this year. They went to Kamurocho. Uh, okay, 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 um, 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 that, um, this, this was a preview by Hambone, that, of something there, I have the final version too, but just the crop is very good, <laughs> it's just that one tells the story, um, Silent Shadow put Donkey Kong into, um, Watch for Guns of Icarus, he's firing that laser, he's, Steam, he's coconut laser. Uh, I sent this one to Onsta already, but Omar Mustard put Donkey Kong in Color Funk Arcade. I think Todd saw this too. I'll make sure he saw it. Onsta's chewing on some of the cables. But it's fine. It's real good. Um, thick Room. Donkey Kong went to Dong So. And he saw some kind of banana nonsense. It's very good. Uh, Toodles. Posted clearly you don't own an air fryer. Flavier posted clearly you own an air fryer. And then Rogue Keychain said unclearly you might own an air fryer. Um, this is the final art by Hambone. Where your tax bananas really go. Uh, you have bananas hoarded by the 87 banan percent by Diddy here. Washington Fat Kongs. Donkey Kong King K roll over here as honest blue collar Kremlins and Funky Kong died for your sins And Dan's loving it <laughs> Um, Dracina made like a legit really cool pattern This like light version and this darker version and it just like looks real cool They posted like just the uh, the tileable version and, and separately and they're like you can wallpaper it, I guess. Looks great. Uh, Sound Shadow posted this. Mario's having a good time. Isaac Star Town. It's Friday. It's Friday. It's Fry Kong Night. There it is. Donkey Chan. Da 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 da. Uh, and then on November 1st, um, like, like 15 users just posted this saying my face went Donktober over. Everyone got real sad real quick. But it wasn't over yet. Sound Shadow posted this abomination. He's got pistachio mouth. And a Hershey kiss for a head. Uh, I, this is... This is bad. This is actually very bad. Um... Missing Legend. Missing Donktober here. Donktober. Donktober. He said. Just join. Hey, welcome. We're just enjoying Donktober, which is just past. And Purple Soft Drink posted this. This is a false headline. Don't be. No, it's gone. It's done. Make sure you check the uh, the Discord for the Donktober channel because it's going to be gone. If there's anything that you saw, you want to grab or whatever. Do it today or tomorrow, probably. Do it now. Anyway, it's done. Goodbye. Goodbye, Donktober. Gone, but not forgotten. Anyway. Who made this DJ Khaled mix? Uh, that was made by uh, White Hawk. White Hawk Workshop. Um, it's very good. Also, the, the the it is it is on YouTube, which maybe I, I should I shouldn't share this, but it's it's just this. This is just the whole video. It's just this looping. It's very good. It's very good. I need it. I'll post it in the chat. Um. Uh, there you go. There was a direct direct download on the um. On the Discord server itself. Um, hold on a second. Anyway, why is there a dong screen when I walked in? Because we just had Dongtober through the month of October, and it is sadly gone. But a lot of people made the most of it, and I wanted to share some of the literal works of art people whipped up. So that wasn't everything. There's more in the server that I did not. 
uh, grab, but um, shout outs to everyone who celebrated the Dongtober season. Hope you enjoyed it. It'll be back next year, bigger and donger than ever. Um, thank you a lot. Um, was that an entry? It sure was. Yeah. Thank you, Rosie. Every year. Uh, in between streams, Dingle Doof resub for 16 months. Thank you very much. Uh, Smash Rat, thanks for 10 bits. Um, uh, been a Simpsons mood as of late. Wish these the Ian, the very tall man, more. The guy who Nelson laughs at since he's too tall for his car in 22 short films about Springfield. I love his voice. Very matter of fact, will sound very goofy esque. Nice. Thank you. Naked Arcade Bubbles, thanks for 50 months. That's as many as five tens, and that's terrible. I agree. Uh, Drake Arcanus, thanks for five months. Smash Bad, thanks for 60 habits. Incidentally, I'm almost certain this was pointed out last stream, but I love how Manny said he wouldn't be happy working on a boat until he was captain in the first chapter. It's a nice bit of foreshadowing. Guess he performed that mutiny after all. Yeah, it's not really established what happened, but... Yep, he became captain. It's a very fun bit of foreshadowing. You got too much poo, Burmer. We got you. Garbage ape is momentary, dong is forever. I think it's the opposite. Unfortunately, for all of us. Dragon with a Fez, thanks for 10 months. Johnny Spud, thanks for 38 months. Copenick, thanks for 23. Crow Fact, I was visited by crows for the first time in months today. Oh, also, crows have a nine-year average lifespan. Just like a cat. Has nine years lives. Right? That's what that, yeah. That's what that means. Hovlex, what the hell are you doing? Thank you. Uh, Phoenix. Thanks for two years. Enjoy your house key. Crows are really cool. They're very smart. Uh, enjoy your house key. I found my modded 3DS in my in an old old satchel bag. I try to interact with it, but I don't want to ruin my sight. <laughs> Bar F. Yeah, I mean the first half. Shit. Goon. Thanks for a soup. Smash that with a soup. Smash that with ten bits. Uh, no one took adventure advantage of Watober, hoping there'd be a Wario Donkey Kong pick, but no such luck. Well, be the change you want to see in the world. Create that Wario hanging out with Donkey Kong in Aruba fan art that we all want and need. You have the power. I'm doing Donkey Kong Coyote. How you doing? Did you just miss my recap of Don Tober, Donkey Kong Coyote? Shit. Got stepped up. Oh, Mortharos. Take me out like Don Tober. So sad. Alexander Hamilton. What? My name's not Alexander Hamilton. So please don't call me Alexander Hamilton. That's not my name. Not my name. What a workshop! Thank you. I appreciate it. I'll get to that in one second. Um, Rosie the Row, thanks for the spooky, scary skeleton bits. Fitting for the spooky skeleton. Don't pay attention to the man smoking. Remember, smoking kills you. Look at look at Manny. If you need proof that smoking kills, just look at him. He's not doing great. He's all he's all bone, no skin. Where's the smoke even going? It's just blowing out the back of his skull. It's awful. Anyway, Rosie the Road, thanks for the skeleton bits. Don't mind me, just wanted to set the mood. Appreciate it. Ryan, thanks for 100 bits. Have you considered privating the Dongtober channel so it basically becomes invisible and inaccessible to anyone other than the mod so you can just unprivate it next year, making it so folks can perpetually enjoy past year's Dongtober works? Simply suggestion as a mod for Jars on Discord with seasonal channels. Uh, Ryan, I believe that's exactly how it's handled. Um, I mean, I, I let the mods on the, the Discord server handle most things, but I believe it's the same Dongtober channel. We just unprivate it and then, so you can, you should be able to just scroll up a long time. If not, then uh, we'll do that in the future because it's easier than just making a new channel. I do like to speak fast and I should slow down, but I don't. Game smart. Yeah, they're all great. Same Dongtober channel, um, but you should be able to just scroll up and find Dongtober of Days Yore. Speak faster. I just, I'm trying to get caught up on alerts and stuff so we can get back to the video game. So I'm excited and I'm talking fast. Polar Bear Pet, thanks for 20 months. Princess Kelso, thanks for three months. Thanks for the fun streams. Thank you for enjoying them. And thank you. I hope you enjoy your silver key. Uh, ba, 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 my, I cannot. <laughs> Same dong, new tober. I know, video, all right, right? I know. I know, video games. Zen Ominous, thanks for five months. Love the streams and the VODs these last few months. Keep being awesome. Thank you. It's very kind. Hoflex, thank you for five. Five gifted subs. Tomatist, Millhouse, Julius Maxwell, Zinric2, Joshua Caleb75, and Armed and Psycho. I hope you all enjoy the emotes. You got Manny for today, and then he's being banished probably to BTTV or something. So I hope you enjoy the bar eh, for another day. He's a little, he's a little captain man. He's, he's wearing a little, he's got like a turtleneck and a big old coat. 
Me when I smoke 800 packs of... <laughs> Did you censor Marlboro? <laughs> Hi, crowds. Hey, crowds, do you know offhand if uh, the uh, the Dongtober channel on the Discord is just the same Dongtober channel? And we're just privating and unprivating? I think that's how we've done it. So. We're gonna sprout up. Yeah, we're gonna sprout a lot. I got a gift sub. You did! Enjoy the emotes. Whitehawk Workshop! Thank you for the hammy. Uh, buying myself more time to finish watching the VOD of the first half. Also, ah, can't believe you looped Big Bang Donk Kong for the whole Donktober recap. Glad y'all liked it. It's art, Whitehawk. Thank you. It's the same one. That's what I assume. So please private it. I'm gonna give people a day or two. It's November! <laughs> I know. I know. Um, I'm gonna give people a day or two to, to grab anything. I just did a recap of Donktober. So I want to give people an opportunity if there was something they wanted to give a thumbs up to or yell at whoever made it. Um, but we're gonna archive Donktober channel like tomorrow. So, you know, well, maybe day after. So Vibe Watch, okay, well, soon. You don't have time. If you're watching this, you're out of time. It's not Donktober. It's no Kong November. <laughs> it's, it, you're, if you draw Donkey Kong, it's illegal. <laughs> it's not allowed. Anyway, um, uh, yeah, maybe it's been in the storage closet where people can still visit it. That might be- we can probably do that. Anyway, we'll figure it out. Uh, illegal dongs in this zone. Um, uh, let me just do these things over here, and then we welcome back to Grim Fandango. Uh, he's gonna throw that on the ground. Uh, it's year three in Grim Fandango. Um, yeah, check it out. We put it in the closet so no one- no one's dong is out. Yeah, well, that's against Discord TOS, so... We gotta behave by the rules. Uh, well, so, okay, so last- if you missed the previous Grim Fandango, or maybe you just need a recap, because, you know, yeah, he can- he can spin. Um, yeah, he likes the litter. Um, we are Manny Calavera. We are a- essentially a travel agent in the land of the dead. We're in the eighth underworld. Um, and we are basically a, not the, a Grim Reaper. Uh, we put on a little, a little cloak and a little scythe and we go stomping around the land of the living. When people die, we bring them back to the land of the dead. And then based off of two factors, one, how much money they were buried with, and two, uh, how good a person they were in the land of the living determines the, uh, the effective travel package they are eligible for to travel to the ninth underworld, the next world after this one. Um, if you were a really good person, then you are eligible for a, the best of the best, which is a ticket on the number nine express. It's a fancy train that takes you to the ninth underworld in four minutes instead of walking on foot, which takes up to four years. So, uh, you want to be a good person and maybe, you know, have some cash. But turns out there's corruption and shenanigans and mysteries afoot because even though he's good at his job, uh, he keeps getting... Uh, crappy clients, and when he does get someone who seems to be a good client, types their shit in the computer, and it spits out being like, nope, they're not eligible for anything good. So, he learns there's a deeper conspiracy at play, and his boss and his uh, other co-worker are, are working behind the scenes to somehow rip off people, and it, the whole game is rigged. Yeah, so, it all comes to a head when he steals a client from his, um, uh, rival sales guy, Domino, uh, who we will be seeing shortly. Domino, uh, is a piece of shit, but he's just kind of a smarmy salesman. Um, we steal a client from him who's effectively a, an angel. She's perfect, and she's not eligible for anything good. So we're like, what? How is she not eligible? She's literally, she hasn't murdered anyone. Um, so, uh, she disappears, goes off walking to start her four-year journey, which she should not have to walk. Um, and so Manny feels an obligation to set things right. So he's trying to find her. Her name is Meche. Her name is Mercedes, Meche for short. Uh, he's trying to catch Meche, uh, and, and help her get to the Ninth Underworld because he feels a, a sense of obligation to her. Um, in the meantime, we joined a, uh, resistance, La Revolution, the Lost Souls Alliance, um, unwittingly just to get the hell out of town. Uh, they're trying to reveal the corruption that's going on and how people aren't getting what they're in entitled to, uh, by being good people or whatnot. Um, and we met up with, uh, our driver, Glottis who is a big, uh, demon, who, if he's not near cars, he dies, because he was raised from the land of the dead to work on cars. Uh, and he's been joining us on our adventure. He's a real good boy. Um, what else? So, basically, we traveled out of the main town we started in, across the petrified forest, to Rubicava, which is the port city that everyone traveling, basically other than by train, needs to pass through Rubicava on their journey to the Ninth Underworld. Um, we set up shop there, spent a year there, that's year two. So then we're in Rubicava, 
trying to figure out what to do because we've been waiting a year for Meche to show up, right? It shouldn't take her a year to get from El Mara, where the game starts, to Rubicava, but every day he's like, is she showing up? No. So she does show up on the, 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 it's November 2nd, a year later, Dia de los Muertos, and he catches her being grabbed onto a ship by Domino. He sees her being kidnapped or something. We don't know what's going on, but she's on a ship headed for Porto Zapato, shoe port. Uh, so he's like, I need to get on a boat and get the hell out of Dodge to Porto Zapato to chase down after Meche uh, and find out what the hell Domino's up to. So we run around doing a bunch of puzzles in Rubicava, basically get onto a boat, which is this boat, and then a year passes. We've been on a boat for a year trying to get to Porto Zapato, and we have just now learned that uh, there's custom agents on board that are probably assassins set to kill us, um, and we need to figure out what the hell's going on because we're probably going to get murdered before we can catch up to that ship. Hi, Dan. Uh, I think that's the most important strokes. And the last detail is that uh, the, the, the guy who is behind the corruption going on with the tickets and uh, people not getting what they're supposed to is this big skeleton man named Hector Lamond. He seems to be, he's got a fez and he's large and he seems to be the one behind. He, he murdered our old boss. So he's the bad news and I'm sure we'll not see him again. It's fine. A port shoe? Uh, we're going to, we're trying to get to port shoe. Yeah, and uh, because we're it, we're undead, dead beings, uh, you die by being sprouted, where you're shot with little plant bullets that grow life out of you. And Swanky Max made his best song. Anyway, so uh, I think that's what you need to know. And also, he doesn't like to use his scythe on anything. That's also important to know. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. My scythe. Yeah, I that's. Like to keep it next to where my heart used yeah, to that, be. Yeah, that's what. He, yep. That's also the only thing we have on our inventory right now. Uh, I'm gonna turn up the volume a smidge. Also, um, I turned VSync off. I was running into situations last stream where it was getting real laggy when there was like two characters on screen. So there might be like a, occasional screen tearing. Hopefully it's not too bad, but I'd rather it just run smoother. So yeah, it's expensive. Yeah. Can you explain the Atremides boss fight from Wild Cataclysm? Yeah, so Atremides... I don't know anything about WoW. <laughs> uh, but we need to get... the hell... I think Glottis worked on this ship. I have a slight hunch that Glottis did some work here. Uh, my scythe. My my scythe. I think I'll leave them tied until I find out what's going on. Um... Tied nice and strong. We almost lost her at the last port, but it looks like they learned their lesson. No matter how heavy deck furniture looks, always use the proper cleats. That's good advice, Manny. Thank you. My si my scythe. My scythe. No signs of Gladys here. Nope. Uh, maybe into the... Can I not... Oh, there we go. Oh, Ensign. no. Oh, no. Ensign Arnold was just a kid. He was just a boy. I'm sorry I led you into trouble, sailor. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Ensign Arnold was... No, not hit. Not... We need to go... Oh, fuck. Our whole fucking crew was murdered. Um, for someone who's dead, this is, like, the most terrifying this sight. can't be happening. All these plants, man. Hey! He's back here! Sack him! Gladys! Custom officials, open his door! Ooh. Yeah, we want to check your bags. <laughs> Don't worry, Captain. We're safe in here. It's very believable. Okay, let's just set the explosives and get the hell out of here. Oh my God, Gladys's face. <laughs> How you doing? Hey, can I talk to you, buddy? Oh. Can't reach. Can't reach. Looks like the anchor's down. Uh huh. How you doing, buddy? What is it? Oh. That's the starboard anchor control. Uh-huh. No, well, we got ourselves a little puzzle, don't we? I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, as opposed to the hands-on method. Here's your survivoring, yeah. Híjole. Gladys sure did a number on that old diesel. If it were just a little more powerful, we could probably tear on out of here. I tried. Oh, I tried. <laughs> but I failed. It's not powerful enough. Hey, maintain, sailor. He's doing his best. That's the port anchor control. Port anchor. Uh-huh. 
Well, now our anchors are up, right? Oh, no. Whoa. Oh, no, I do have an anchor down. Boy, that sounds awful. <laughs> Let's get that one up. Yeah, right. Full speed ahead. Why am I not moving? Back it up. What what if we uh left? You think that we would like move or something? Oh, I'm still tied to the dock. Can I just rip the dock off with me? Oh? Oh. Huh oh. Now forward. It's not powerful enough. How did... They'll never find me there. This isn't at all suspicious for the assassins trying to murder us, right? Huh. Um... I mean, th this is pro... Oh. Nope. Now, what if we... What if we did this? I don't know what this would do for us, but we can grab it. Right? Yeah, grab it. Grab it. Glottis is a weapon. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Yeah. What? What are you doing? What are you... <laughs> it felt a little... A little... What? Is... Did I... Can't reach. Oh, sure. Now I find an actual rusty anchor. It says... Inspected by number 36? 36? Okay, well, maybe maybe we try again. <coughs> I don't <clears throat> Why does it keep going up and down randomly? <laughs> huh. Huh. This doesn't seem right. Okay, maybe maybe not. Um What about this side? Maybe grab oh, this sure. one. No, it says this one was also inspected. I'm actually pushing the button. Well, I'm just looking at it. Oh sure, it says he's looking at the anchor. He's interacting with it on his own for some reason. It. It. Huh. I thought that was part of it. <clears throat> Maybe not. Maybe I gotta move the ship somewhere first. Move it back over. Did that not... Lower the anchor, then sight it? Alright, trying to... Hmm. Okay, so turning it left brings it back over. Uh huh. You do. I think I want it up though, so I can grab it. I seem to recall needing to hook it and like loop it into the window, but maybe there's a specific order you need to do all that in. Maybe you shouldn't have put the boat controls in the room. Listen, that's why you have communication. Hmm. Why can't I talk to uh, Glottis? Hard to totally panic when you're wearing that little sailor suit. No, it's not! <laughs> Gladys, do okay, something. There we go. Okay. Gladys, do something. Okay. Gladys, do something. Okay. <laughs> Gladys, do something. Okay. It's hard to totally. No! Alright, um. Hit the button. It's down. Move, move, move it with, with the anchor down. This voice changed. No. So I can. Okay. All right. God, I I remember this being. A strange sequence of nonsense. 
like a lot of the puzzles in this. Um, can what happens if I if I raise anchor now? Is it just gonna come back? Yeah, all right. Hmm. Yeah, they're they're bad at finding explosives. So lower this anchor, and then move over. <clears throat> if anyone remembers what to do here, I would not be opposed to a uh, a hint because you gotta connect them. Hmm. Hmm. Maybe raise this. Lo lower it. Move it over. And now we'll, we'll, that'll stay there and we'll move, right? Yep. That'll be underneath the ship. Yep. And now I can lower the one on the right. And then those will, those will, and now, and now move it back That's over. The... Now move it back over. Are they going to hook each other? That's not right. You know, raise the left, hit right, lower left, lower right, and raise right, then lower right, then move forward. Huh? Make them kiss. Raise left, hit right, lower left, lower right, raise right, lower right. That doesn't... No, you have to move around in order to get them tangled, right? Up, up, down, 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 yeah. Now if I raise this side... Okay, okay, wait, 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 this is good. They're locked together like plastic monkeys from a barrel. Can't reach. Okay, now I use the thing? I think. Yeah, the animation... I, I, I forgot this step. I remembered hooking something. The animation felt weird. Yeah, there you go. There, yeah. Nice. Well, there you go. That's good for the ship. Um. They're locked together. Can't reach. Wait, they're right there. Now raise the other anchor. Right, now raise this one. And uh, maybe hold on to something. Gladys, cover your ears. Probably should have said that first. What was that? The dotted line, buddy. Um, and now book it or reverse. Maybe we need a reverse. There you go. There you go. Yep. That's how boats work. See you later, suckers. As long as you have the part with the engine, you're fine. Oh, they named the ship Lola. She's the photographer that got murdered. That's Just a sad. Little farther, Gladys. <laughs> no, his hat! No! You told me there was a reason I drew the email without his hat? No! Shit. Fuck. Well, good thing we can hold our breath for 10 minutes. <laughs> Manny, choking! Mira, snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say, you what? don't have lungs. Hey, you yeah. live without your heart once, so you can live without air Be with for you in a, a moment. While, just until I figure out what we're gonna do. I sunk to the bottom of the sea. Oh. But I'm wearing a little suit. Look. How you doing, Michael? Doing well. Slowly losing my mind for Indy Land. Oh, Indy Land? What's that, Michael? Indy Land is our annual charity event that we at TOVG run. It's a great cause where we spotlight indie games and also raise money for dementia research. Oh. Collectively, hmm. entering our fifth year, I can proudly say that we'll have raised over a million dollars for dementia research. Holy hell. And hey, 
Speaking of holy things, you, Barry Kramer, a me? Have, have been one of the people who's helped us, us do all those great things. I did do all that by myself and not with the help of an amazing chat that was supportive towards the cause. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. but, that, um, I did that. But I, I also believe that our opening ceremonies is uh, this Sunday. This Sunday? Yes. And I'm what? pretty sure that you might be stopping by. I might be stopping by. Yeah, you'll oh. be joining Gerard playing some awesome games like oh. Backpack Hero and Floppy Nights. What? You played Floppy Nights. I played Floppy Nights. Floppy Nights. Yeah, I did. And we'll be uh, joined by the Debs while that's happening. Oh so my you, God. Can, you can, you know, talk to them about design decisions what? or artwork. Or... What are the chances? Uh, the chances are high. They oh. guarantee that. Okay, well yeah. that's cool. Yeah. Um, what what's what's with the, uh, the oh. swag there? Oh, this I ca is can't this help but notice some high quality merchandise that, yes. that is on your person. High quality merchandise that if for some reason you went to what is it eventbrite.com uh, eventbrite just Google it just Google it chat dot indie land twenty twenty two dot com you can buy tickets to actually come to indie land uh, next weekend the eleventh through the thirteenth you join can us be there in the bourbon room in Hollywood it's it, if you're in L A it's otherwise might need to book some airfare yes yes <laughs> yes. But uh, and and if you come, you get one of these cool bags along Whoa. with a bunch of other nifty merch. Whoa! Yeah, that's but, amazing. Yeah, it is amazing. Almost as amazing as you. Wow. Well, uh, uh, oh. 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 Goodbye. Thank you, chat. You're sexy. Did you know that? They knew that. Good. Goodbye, Michael. Goodbye, Barry. See you on Sunday. Who was that? Beware. Brave captain, here in the darkest depths of the Sea of Lament dwell the most horrible monsters of all. The fearsome, murky demons of the deep also, will the swallow you whole the England. instant you leave this I don't think they are, light. but they know it. Heed my warning, or take one but. step forward <laughs> and learn for yourself. All right, all right, I believe you. Just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land voice. Huh? Well, uh, I guess we can't walk off that way. Ram, a bam. Thank you. Here comes one now. Sir. I love how Gladys okay, watches him go. Might not have been a sea monster. But it was pretty spooky. That was pretty spooky. Um, <laughs> yeah, thanks for the link there, Rand. Yep, if anyone's interested in attending Indie Land in person, it is not too late to grab a ticket. It might be too late if you're not in town, but if you're in town, hey, check it out. Oh, there he goes. Not blue yet. You all right? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Hang in there, Manu. He's doing fine. Well, we, we still got our scythe, right? Hmm. What could I use that with? My scythe. Yeah, I know. My scythe. Yeah, I know. Anything I can grab? I don't want to mess up my blade. Yeah, I know. I don't want to mess. Yeah. What is that over there? Hmm. Time to kill Gladys. <laughs> I definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. According to our map, I think that's the pearl. That's the pearl. Oh, we were looking for that. Um. Hmm. According to Indiana Jones what the? has a phobia, and it's snakes, and it's snakes, Thank and it's you. snakes, but he keeps living anyway, yeah. till he falls in a pit and he quakes, cause it's still the snakes, thing. and if there's a reason I'm still alive, with the number of snakes here is five, I'm willing to wait for it, I'm willing to snake for it. Dragon with a fez! Thank you very much! That soul has already been reaped. Hijole, he looks like he's been down here a long time. Can I talk to him? Shit. Okay, well, that's why I put down a save. <laughs> so, I don't have to wait for him to do a whole lap again. Yeah, he just goes around in a circle, it seems. Hey, buddy. What are you doing? Ready? Oh, there he is. Amigo. Huh? Who? Oh, jeez, another shipwreck. You see? That's why I never travel by boat. Oh. Good. Um, let me get cop real quick. Uh, Kiyoki, thanks for 15 months. Let's get bony. 
Uh, maybe thanks for 100 bits. Barry, in chat, yesterday was my birthday. Came to drop some bits as is tradition. Now I gotta go again. Have a good one. Happy bladed birthday. Hope you had a good one. Also, chat is cute. Good night. Good night, baby. Thank you. Lonely Wheel, thanks for 14 months and it's here. Three? I'm on a boat. Ah, shit. Arcas, thanks for a year. Want to use this 12 month sub to say thanks for being really totally cool people this past month. Streaming VODs have been really great and ready for the next months. Thank you very much, Arcas. Enjoy your mildly Chris Skelton Rosie the Row, thanks for a soup. Gotta go to bed now. Catch you later, Skelly Man. Uh, have a good snooze. I'm Danny VV. Thanks for two months. Enjoy your bronze key. Welcome back. India Land starts November 11th. Thanks for the dollar. Uh, that was that for a little bit. Dragons with the Fez. Thanks for a hammy. It's my birthday, so you know what that means. It means it's your birthday. Happy birthday. Hope you're having a good day. Thanks so much for the hammy. I don't understand it, but I appreciate it. And you know, damn it. Thank you. Um, We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Can you eat him? Uh, Glottis might be able to. Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry, I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> hmm. 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 I don't want to break your stride. Hmm. Could we tag along with you? Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. We don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. I don't have a gun. Scare away sea monsters, yeah. I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Now what do we do? We're out of songs. Well, the good news is we made some good distance, so I'm sure we'll get to our new destination. Oh. Well, shit. I thought that looked like our ship. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Makes everything look the same after a while, like he was going in circles. Well, this isn't the kind of progress I was hoping for. Oh, well, the wet march of the soul ain't for everybody. I don't like wet march of the soul as a phrase. Um... What are you doing down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicaba for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? Down B, I don't know why I never play Smash Bros. How do you know where you're going? See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. He's a smart man, that one. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Ain't you, boys? How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. Mm-hmm. Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've already done it. In a boat. A boat? Don't talk to me about boats. He is Mr. Wetbones. He is indeed Mr. Wetbones. What's the problem with boats? We had such a nice boat. Why is everybody always talking about boats? You got a perfectly good pair of legs. Why not use them, I say? Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We'd started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. 
What happened in the end? What happened was, I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. Oh. Was he eaten? <laughs> How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. I don't think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Could you send Oop. for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by. This game was written in the, in the 90s. Cut some slack. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. Hmm. Could you take us to the pearl? Ha! You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing What's ships? What's a phone booth? sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Bah! I've been walking this ocean for years. I ain't never seen it. Hmm. Uh, phone booths are these rectangles in cities that Batman had installed Superman had somewhere to change. It's true. No, really. The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker. That's the moon. Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon. <laughs> well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? Oh, they don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for them. <laughs> this little light. Um. Of mine, I'm gonna let come it back. shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little Can't light steal of that? mine. Hey, Leo! Lego! 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 Damn. Get your own lamp, pal! Whatever happened to the code of the sea? Shit. Well, he'll be back. Old Chipito. Not blue yet. You alright? I'm a spirit of not a hang in there. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, there he goes. So we need some way of either stealing his lamp or getting him to take us to the pearl. Time to reap him. He's already been reaped. He can't reap someone who's dead. Four to six business weeks. Cut off with a scythe. That's kind of what I was thinking, but... Don't know how well that's going to work. Just take the entire boy. Just have Gladys carry him. My scythe. My... 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 My scythe. My... My my scythe, my scythe, my scythe, my scythe, my scythe, my 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 scythe, my scythe, my 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 scythe, my scythe, my 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 s my s my s my s Okay, <laughs> Shit, get back here. That soul has our ihole. He looks like he's been down Fuck. here a long time. Shit. Okay, hold on. Oh, fuck. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, hold on, hold on. Hey, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back, come back. Mice it is. Mice, 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 mice. You gotta talk to him first from the stand over there. Mice, 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 mice. 
Smash Bad, thanks for my 10 bits. My this guy's voice my actor, he's voiced by Jack my Angel. He did a ton of voices for Hasbro and Hanna-Barbera Productions my and Disney Pixar my movies. The voice of Mr. Shark in Toy Story. My he's Howdy Howdy my Howdy Guy? My oh my shit. My 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 no, I'm able to walk out into the dark. No. It's got an invisible wall. It's just that one time monologue from from Gladys. All right, I'm saving again. Should be coming up. Mice, 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 mice. Hello, amigo. What? More survivors? I just passed another shipwreck not five minutes ago. Well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under. I'm gonna let it hide it. I'm gonna. That light is. Hide it. I'm gonna. Why can't I use my fucking scare Scare away. Scare away. My sight. What the fuck? I like to keep it next to where my heart. Pressing the interact button just skips ahead his dialogue. Hmm. All right. Amigo, what? I just well, okay. This little light oh of mine. Oh my god. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. And then I'm gonna let it shine. This trying to talk to him again just does this. Hey, Leo. Oh. What am I supposed to do with this? Follow me. Where are you taking me? Oh, okay. We're going to the moon. That's silly. Yep. I didn't realize you could move while you were yanking Benny, on him. Is that the pearl? I knew I'd find her someday. I'm rich, 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 rich. Shh. Something's happening. Benny, what's going on? What? Hmm. Hmm. I don't know, but I don't like the way that thing's looking at us. Hmm. There's no talking to octopuses. Everyone knows that. I think we found our trap. I'm not going down there while that monster's looking right at me. That octopus is tracking us. I had no idea their eyesight was so good. That I, I there's no talking to octopuses. Hmm. Gladys, go down there and talk demon talk to that octopus. Heck no! I'm scared. I'm staying up here with you. Still not blue. Does he have secret gills somewhere? He hasn't been near an engine in a minute either. Maybe the I guess the boat counts that as an engine. I had um, go over here. Oh, the octopus is following us. Ew. Ew. The sea is his domain. He's a land demon, though. Not quite as famous as the pearl is the slimy barnacle covered old rock of legend. I don't want to get tangled up in those. Touch it. Ugh. Watch those hands, clams. Uh, scythe? Can I scythe them? I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to miss. I don't want. Not quite as faint. Really? I don't want to. Okay. All right. Mice, 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 mice. Um. Hey, Leo. Oh. Well. Lego, Lego, Lego. Did I just solve a puzzle? Where are you going? You can't leave me here all alone. Oh, this is fucked up. I'm back here. She's coming back. Poor Chapito, he didn't deserve that. The puzzle was walk behind rock. Yep. This is quite amazing. Looks like we're heading south. 
But there's nothing on that edge of the world! Except the edge! The edge of the world! Oh well. <laughs> and once again, adventure game protagonists are monsters. Yep. Manny? Don't ask, Carnal, because I don't know. Getting a little blue around the edges. See any hint of that octopus swimming around here? No, but I can smell them. I don't know if smelling underwater is a good idea. Dark water is that direction. Oh. Can I go inside first? Doesn't qualify them by himself. No kidding. Gladys. I'm gonna sneak inside and look for Mechi. What if that octopus comes back while you're gone? Poke him in the eye and steal his sub. <laughs> Stupid octopus. It's a good thing that they have no airlock, just an elevator that just fills up with water and then rides back up. I wanna see what's... Can I, can I go this way too? There are lights. Oh. Hmm. So I can reverse that. How convenient. This old conveyor belt looks like it's about to fall apart. What? Why are you? Why would you get onto that, Manny? Oh. Well. Here, here I go, I guess. Uh, 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 let's get off of that. Okay. What? Oh. Yeah, this, this seems to be a, an entire thing I shouldn't be doing yet. Let's bring that back. Okay. Yeah, he's gonna be fine. Can I run down this? Wow. I mean, he's got some strong legs. Let him go. Uh oh. Oh. Don't go that way then. Yeah, that is the edge of the world. I don't really want to fall off that. Um. Can I, uh, hop off? Okay. Strong bones. Bones of a champion. All right, that's, that's probably fine. Nothing there. Set back. Hey, Gladys. Let me know if you need any air. I'm just running around. What's all this? I'll bet all these miners were brought here by that octopus. Well, at least it didn't eat them. Lay down your tools. We're busting out of here. Man, if I had only gotten that book back from Terry, I could really start some trouble here. Hey, I Brad, how you doing? I'll bet all these miners were brought. Well, lay down. We're okay. They don't seem interested in stopping. Nothing here. Oh, it's back here. I don't know how I get down there without this current taking me over the edge. Okay. Understood. Then let's skedaddle. Another Union Revolt? This time of the year? Alright. Let's go see if Meche's here. Got a door to the left. Some kind of path over here. Oh. Oh. Man, that ashtray's so fancy you could eat caviar out of it. Yeah, Manny. Priorities. Okay. That is a fancy ashtray. Hmm. In this part of the realm will get entirely underwater. Better believe it. <gasps> Bucket! It's empty. It's empty. It Grab it! Meche. Manny, what are you doing here? I wanted to see how your trip was going, Angel. I am your travel agent, you know. 
By the way, thanks for that bottle of champagne you sent me. It really... Oh, yeah, she threw a bottle at us. You were headed for a trap. I was trying to warn you. Domino was using me like bait. I didn't want you to end up a prisoner here like me. Prisoner? Where is your cell? Or are you just sharing a bunk with the warden? If that's what you think of me, then why did you come here? Because this is where he belongs. Here, working for me. I knew you'd come around eventually. Right or wrong, Manuel Calavera is always with the winning team, right, Manny? That's why you're here now. I'm getting off this rock, and I'm taking all of these people with me. <laughs> Manny, there's no way off this island. I'm afraid you're stuck here in my little executive training program. See, I need you to take my place here, kid. I've got to get back to the city where the action is. Sorry, Manny, but I had to come in. My skin was getting all pruney. Him, I don't need. I'm gonna grind you to powder for that, cow. Gladys! Maybe later. But for now, let me just show you your new office. Mom, oh, my office is getting punched in the face. I can Careful, take that baby. at home. The new boss is waking up. He murdered Glottis. Sent What? Manny, you're right there. You're right there, Manny. He's fine. I like my old desk better. No drawers. Hello. This is sad. Hola, angelitos. I'll bite you, I swear to God. Please don't bite anyone else, Pugsy. That's why they put us in the cage in the first place. Hmm, I'm gonna turn up a volume of smidge. Uh, Alright, okay. Crowds sent me a, a tweet with this image. My body is a machine that turns cigarettes into smoked cigarettes. Thanks, crowds. That is, that is topical. I will agree. Um, Goon, thanks for 69 bits. Nice. Welcome back. What's not nice is the way Glottis was just fucking written out of the game. Um, Why do you want to bite me? You're the mean new boss. Mr. Hurley said you were meaner than him. He said you had a bone saw. You bite me and I'll sue your parents. Our, Our parents? parents? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, hey, don't cry, children. Please, stop crying. Why am I so bad at this? My name is Manny Calavera. What's yours? Mr. Harley told us about you. Mm -hmm. You're the one who tricked Meche. Poor Meche. It's a great way to start a conversation. <laughs> I'll tell your parents. <laughs> I didn't trick anybody. Mr. Hurley said he was supposed to take care of Meche, but you stole her case from him. Is that true? Not just kids. We made orphans cry. It's better. Let me see if I can explain this whole thing to you. You see, I had this job, selling travel packages to immigrant souls. If I sold enough of them, I got to leave the land of the dead. Now, I was in a slump, and I really needed a fat commission, so... You're a bad man. Go away, bad man! Yeah, go away! Yep. They're not wrong. Uh... Mitch is my friend. You can ask her. She talked about you before. Every time she says your name, she looks so sad. I don't know what you did to her, but you're gonna be sorry! What are you two doing in this cage? Making light bulbs. Look, we're working as hard as we can. Why don't you leave us alone? Listen, children, I'm here to help. There's really not much more room in here. Your hands are too big to make light bulbs. They're abandoned unorphans. Yeah. We are talking to two dead children in a cage, no matter how you cut it. I'm here to help you get it's out pretty of this dark. cage. You can't do that. We have to stay here and take care of Mitchie. She'd be so sad here all alone. Sometimes we hear her crying, you know. My hands are not too big to make light bulbs. Then why don't you help? My butt's too big to sit on one of those little perches. Ah, oh, 
I'm gonna tell Mecha you said that word to us. I told you he was bad. What, but? Is perch a bad word? I just don't have any of those little tiny tools, that's all. Here, take my hammer. <laughs> <laughs> it is funny that it just bounces off his head. <laughs> you two bad little children. I'm glad you're in a cage. Manny! <laughs> Very bad. Just try to empathize with them makes them cry. Saying you deserve to be in that cage makes them laugh. There's no winning. You know, I really do want to help. Then why don't you? Uh. I'm in the Maritime Union. We can't do factory work. I don't know what those words mean. It means he doesn't want to help us because he's mean. On second thought, maybe I don't. We don't want to either, but we don't have a choice. Nice cage you have there. Uh, hold on. I'm the one who's going to take Meche out of here. What? You can't do that. Who's going to take care of us? We'll be all alone. <laughs> You can't do that. We have to stay here and take care of Mitch. She'd be so sad here all alone. Sometimes we hear her crying, you know. Nice cage you have here. Mr. Hurley grew demon ravens with human heads in here. He said if we ever tried to get away, he'd send the ravens after us and let them make nests out of our bones. You children just wait here and be brave little angelitos, okay? Okay. Great. This is the tiniest little hammer I've ever seen. It is, this is adorable. Look at that. <laughs> this is the tiniest little hammer I've ever seen. I don't really want to do that. Here, take my hammer. Uh, 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 tap, tap, no bats. Okay. Pamela Adl uh, Adlin is the voice of the boy in the cage. Bunch of TV shows. Spinelli and Recess. Remember that from one Saturday morning. Yeah. Very familiar voice. Thanks for the bits. Oh, so that's what that room is. Well. Burp, 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 burp. Oh, look, it's my prince yeah, Bobby, charming. Oh. Are you back here just to insult me some more, or do you just want some ice for your head? Man, that ashtray is so fancy you could eat caviar out of I it. Wanted... Once you got used to the sooty aftertaste, you'd feel like a king. I like the new dress. Well, it's the best I could pull together out here. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get decent fabric and silk stockings on a deserted factory island on the edge of the world? Hmm. No. No, I don't. Come on. We're getting out of here. Trying to steal my commission from Domino again. Manny, don't you ever give up? I'm not after any commission. I just want to get us both out of here. Then why don't you just ask your boss for the day off? <sighs> I can't believe you think he's my boss. He's my arch enemy. I think he's your boss. You think he's my boyfriend. We don't seem to have a good foundation of trust in our relationship, do we? I'm sorry I implied he was your boyfriend. I do trust you. Well, I'm not sure I trust you about that. But I'll tell you one thing that would convince me. Name it. Give me your gun. Sure. Here it is. Okay, look. The problem is I just don't have one. Oh, please, Manuel. <laughs> You work for the most heavily armed organization in the land of the dead. Don't try to tell me they didn't issue you a gun. Uh, uh. I don't work for the most heavily armed organization anywhere. You know, you're right. There are those rumors of that revolutionary army that's been stockpiling weapons. Actually, them, I work for. Manny, <laughs> why don't you come back when you're willing to deal straight with me, okay? <laughs> he is a smooth talker. Hey, about that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. I think we need to talk. Start talking. You're the salesman. Mm, uh, I have a lot of explaining to do, or you have a lot of explaining to do? I have a lot of explaining to do. Save your breath. Domino's explained it all to me already. Uh, you have a lot of explaining to do. Ooh, me? About what? Uh, uh, Why are those children locked up in a cage? With the wings those angelitos have, they're the only things on this island Domino can't control. 
Hey, if they can fly, let's set the kids free to go get help. They can't fly that far, Manny. But they can fly circles around Domino, and they can bite pretty hard. <laughs> Why did you take me out with that champagne bottle? I told you to stop you from falling into Domino's trap. If you had made it on that ship, then you would have ended up... Here? Yes. Hmm. Did that on my own. Why are you working for Domino? I do what he asks only to protect the children. So why did you run out of my office? I felt so embarrassed, and you looked so disappointed in me. I couldn't stand it anymore. Hmm. Then what were you doing that whole year I was in Ubakawa? I was lost. What did you... I don't want to talk about that year, please. Hmm. Has Domino hurt you in any way? Not as much as I've hurt him. Boy, can that guy take a punch. Okay, I'll lay off the questions. Great. Now if we could get you to just lay off the cologne. Hey, I'm a sailor now. We have to wear this stuff. They didn't issue me a gun. What, are you on probation? I'm not buying this, Manuel. Manny, why don't you come? Nah. She's speedrunning that cigarette. Yep. It's empty. Our it's empty. Oop. Our type of business doesn't produce a lot of paperwork. Sir, do you have an appointment? I'm going in there to tell Domino my demands. I don't think you fully understand the chain of command around here. Pugsy and Bibi work for you. You and I work for Domino, who works for Hector Le Mans, crime boss of El Maro. Well, I think it's time for a little corporate restructuring. He's got his, he's got his AirPods in. This is a good track, too. Oh, we got there. He's listening to... What's he listening to? Listen to a podcast or like... Just like... Eurobeat remixes of Disney classics? We got in there. Are you awake? Hit him with the tiny hammer. It's this thing to the Yakuza soundtrack. Mwah. Bone trousel on loop. Bone trousel two times speed. Domino. Domino! You taking your first coffee break already, Calavera? Oh, it's just been activated. Settling. You know, if I ever spoke to my boss, Hector, that way. Oh shit, you can hear the jazz he was listening to. That's actually a really cute touch. You killed my best friend. The demon? Manny, you can use a demon as a driver. Let him carry your messages, let him serve you food. But you can't ever start thinking of them as friends. It's just not natural. You didn't know Glottis. What are you doing out here on the edge of the world? Oh, I know. I ask myself that every day. But I'm going to train you, Manny, to take my place here running this two-bit light bulb factory. How can you keep little children in a cage? Trust me, it's easier than keeping big kids in a cage. Uh... Why don't you just sprout me like you tried a Puerto Zapato? That wasn't me. That was Hector. He's so unimaginative. Just wants to tie up the loose ends, you know? But I believe, however, that you can be rehabilitated through honest work. So I guess we went to Puerto Zapato and had some interaction with them in the interim year. I forget exactly how things shaped out. A lot happens off screen in this game, which is interesting, you know? Uh... What makes you think I'm going to work for you? Well, there's not much to do on this island if you don't work. Is Rubicava the same thing and as Puerto Zapata? Once I'm gone, it will be just you and Meche alone on this deserted I so. island. I thought they were heading for Puerto Zapata, and that's why we need the ship. Don't tell oh, me that, that was that Puerto Zapata. To you. You're right. And he's saying that that was Hector Lamont's doing, not his. I see. I didn't put that together. Thank you. I don't plan to be on this island for very long. Manny, I have all the guns. I have all the transportation. And I have all the brains. What are you gonna do? Um... Shit, I'm gonna puzzle my way out of this. You and Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? Oh no, that's just a side benefit. The real purpose is to have a place we can lock up all those old clients of mine. Can't have good people wandering loose in the land of the dead telling everybody how we stole their double-end tickets, now can we? 
You stole all these people's tickets? Okay, how much of this haven't you figured out, Calavera? Kapal would root all the good clients to me after he switched over their tickets to a secret holding fund. I'd cover up the paper trail, and we'd make sure that the pigeon jumped overboard at the pearl. Mmm. I knew it! You were getting all the good clients. I handled them all, except for Mercedes, who you hijacked for me in that ridiculous hot rod, which I saw, by the way, last time I was in Rubicava. I tell you, Manny, hot rods like that just don't look safe to me. I do like how he's just like, you didn't figure it out? It's like, hey, hold on. <laughs> I'm piecing it together. So it wasn't my fault Mechie didn't get a ticket. You stole it. Well, it's your fault she ended up in the forest instead of coming here right away. But I fixed that. I'm taking Mechie out of this dungeon. Why let him Manny, know? Before I found her, she spent a year out there in a the petrified forest alone because of you. By comparison, I'd say I'm keeping her pretty comfortable here in my uh, dungeon. Wouldn't you say? I mean, I think he's telling him because he knows he's got all the cards over Manny. We're literally on the edge of the world. There's nowhere else to go. So, he's just like, what are you gonna do? One ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? Oh, Manny. We never touch the product ourselves. We sell a ticket to unfortunate souls, unable to lead moral lives because of the crippling amount of cash they were born into. Ah! But you could just take the tickets and leave today. We found a way to make the land of the dead livable. Why would we want to leave? Mm-hmm. Great line. It's a very good line. Born to crippling amounts of cash. Nice island you got here. Unable to yeah, live more the life. previous owners didn't know what they had here. Let us pick it up for a song. They scooped out all the coral they could reach with their crane and then abandoned the plant. But we knew we had what it would take to go the extra distance to the big reef. Are you about to lecture me about the winning attitude again? No! Slave labor, Manny. That's the real ticket to success. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. Hey, so remember uh, in, like, year one when I was like, yeah, Domino's not really a villain, he's just kind of your rival? I mean, he is sitting at a fancy desk going, Slave labor, kid! That's the ticket! And smoking a cigar. Um, I think he might be a bad guy. <laughs> I think he might he might be a little bit of a, a little bit of a bad guy. A little, a little bit. Yeah. So, um children's books. I like to read to the angelitos. It reminds me of better times. It's locked. I, I can't get a book. This place sucks. So, to sum it up, um the boss man who ran the, the Department of the Dead rigged the system so they could basically um, uh, steal legitimate number nine tickets so they could sell them on the black market. Um, he would filter all the best clients over to Domino, who's the guy here. Um, and then the people, the good people who were entitled to number nine tickets, they would effectively kidnap them and bring them here to be slaves for slave labor. Um, so they don't have people running around being like, I should have been on the number nine to make light bulbs. Yeah. So, uh, it's just pretty fucked. <laughs> this is not, not the, uh, not the same, like, warm-hearted rambunctiousness of, say, a Monkey Island game. Like, I want to be a pirate. Oh, no, a ghost pirate. This is, like, corruption and slave labor and criminal enterprises and all kinds of stuff. It's, it's, a uh, it's a wild time. Um, but again, a lot, maybe not underwater slave labor, but like a lot of the like union busting kind of stuff and, and the criminal underworld is harking back to a lot of the, uh, oh geez, to a lot of the, uh, the, the inspirations for this game. A lot of film noir dealt with similar kinds of issues. Hey, I don't, Peter. Well, in context also just makes sense. Some of the puzzles are very bonkers, but everything in context, yeah. There's logic connecting them, at least. The original disco, these are. Oh, you is it? Why, I 
Carter. Look at my eyebrows. Oh, uh, hmm. Show him my tiny hammer. I can do that. Uh, see, I'm gonna bust out of here with this tiny hammer. Well, you really weren't standing in a very safe place. Well, neither are you right now, amigo. Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We, we are done traveling together. I work solo for a friend and I walk alone. Nice drill. Drill? This here is a cordless high-speed reciprocating chisel. And look, it's a bust off. They usually don't give these to the new guys. How'd you get a bust off? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the Big Reef. Hmm. Booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over the ocean floor. Jewelry, precious coins, you people and your fancy boats never know about it. Cause you just never stop and look. Mm-hmm. Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it all for this beauty. You traded jewelry and precious and coins for a power tool? It's a bust all. I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? Uh, a hug? Mm, nope. That's the one thing I ain't got for you. Damn. A towel. Hey, you funny guy. Chalk in. My friend Gladys to be alive. What? What happened? He went over the edge. Oh, stay away from the edge, I tell you. It's dangerous. I've seen whole ships go over it in my time. Their engines in full reverse, trying to drop anchor. But the current, you can't fight her. So stay back. I miss Gladys. How about a pair of nice silk stockings? Ah, oh, now there's a high ticket item. I might be able to get you some, but I gotta tell you, you couldn't afford it. Mm. A boat. There you go again with the boats. You know I don't like them. Why do you have to needle me? Every day. A drink. Ha! We're swimming in the biggest drink there is. Drinks aren't a hot commodity down here. Sorry. A gun. Ooh. That's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? My scythe. You be willing to buy that? Uh, no. When you got something worth trading, come see old Chapito. You do your right. Stupid chisel. Chapito. Huh? Who? What? That tool looks a little overpowered for you. Overpowered? Nothing overpowers Chapito. You say so. Well, I got a long day of refreshing ahead of me, so please bust away. Chapito! Huh? Who? What? Well, I got a please. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He's fine. Hold still. I'm gonna show Domino my tiny tiny hammer. Geppetto, yeah. Chapito. Sir, do you have an appointment? I'm going in there to tell Dom. I don't think you hug me. You. Well. Hey, what's up? Time to do a little murder. Yeah. <laughs> Not with this. This. <laughs> Please put that. That. <laughs> Okay, you can take out the tiny <laughs> hammer if you want. <laughs> That's amazing. <laughs> I'm a murder him. No, I don't think I could take his laughter a second time. <laughs> Shit. He seems completely unaware of how close I am to escape. Uh, damn it. What about the scythe? Please put that away. Okay, he takes that seriously. <laughs> That's Thank you. really good. Thank you. <laughs> uh. Threatening as my tiny hammer is, I don't think she'd count it as a gun. Mm. I like the new dress. Well, it's the best. Mm hmm. He whipped out a gun. He's got a gun. Um, let's see. 
Hello, little ones. Fly, be free, go by Domino. Leave us alone. If we get out again, he'll hurt Meche. Fine then, stay in there. He is mean. Hola, Angelitos. Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. Hey, would one of you children happen to have a gun? Yeah, we do. So stick him up. Let me see it. He doesn't have one. He's such a liar. Oh, yeah? Well, you're stupid. Your light bulbs don't work. Your light bulbs all smell like boogers. Ha, ah, nobody thinks you're funny anymore. Oh, yeah? Well, everybody in this cage is smarter than you. Everybody except for you. Yeah, because I'm especially smarter than you. In your dreams. In your baby bed that's all wet because you wet in it. Shut up, bed wetter. I said shut up. No, no, really. I have to sleep with an umbrella down here. Oh, yeah? Well, at least I never asked Meche to marry me. What? Miss Colomar, you're so pretty. Will you marry me? I never said that! Oh, Miss Colomar! Stupid baby blue beanie bedwetter! Pugsy the Bugsy lies like a rugsy! Will you two just shut up? <laughs> 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 And he's just smoking now. <laughs> God damn it. Hola, Angelitos. Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. Hey, hey, don't cry, children. Please, stop crying. Why am I so bad at this? You children just wait here and be brave little Angelitos, okay? Okay. This conversation started with me asking if either of them has a gun. Just want to state for the record. We, wa we walked into the room with two children in a cage and said, Hey, you two got a gun? This game's good. Hi, Spooky. How you doing? No drawers. Uh, that's kids for you. <laughs> no drawers. I like my old desk better. Uh, howdy, howdy. Hope you're doing good, Spooky. Thanks. 56 months. Wow. <laughs> uh, uh, maybe I can use my tiny hammer with Chapito. That's gotta be worth a minute. Why I oughta uh, hold still. Check this out. Yo, Pito, have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. Mm -hmm. But I'd sure love to give it a test drive. Yeah, there you go. Check that baby out. See you, little chipper. You're okay. No. Well, I got the good drill. It's a buzzer. Oh, ah, quit yelling. Hmm. How'd you get a bus stop? I'm connected and I trade. Mm -hmm. I want to tell you what you be need. Uh, I can't think small, like a knife or dirty books. You got that stuff? Well, no, but practically everything else. Booty? It's all of you, cause you... Give me some booty. I tra you traded... Tr it's well... Mm -hmm. me. Hmm. The dog tries in the wrong items. Yep. So what do I need a big old drill for? Just me and little chipper. It's a bus stop. Going to Mississippi. <laughs> Gonna see Miss Liza. I like Chapito. Is it gun shape? Not really. Ah, oh, sweet Mary. How are we smoking underwater? Manny? La -di -da -di -da -da. You sure about that, bud? Gonna see mm. Miss Liza. La -di -da -di -da -da. Very carefully. Um, y'all see? They don't need air. Where's the smoke coming from? Check this out. I think I'd try couples counseling first. Uh huh. Hey, about that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I... Right. Listen, Manny... Mm. So, 
do you have I'm I pug you Check this baby out. Please put that away. God, thank you. The conveyor belt. Yeah, maybe I need to hop back on the conveyor. <laughs> Last thing I'd think of. Hey, project. Thank you. Welcome back. Get up on the hydra's back. Boy. Um. Let's turn it. Make it go up. You can get something from uh, Meche now? Can I? Can I? Hmm. Don't know what. Couldn't use the drill with her. Let's see what else is different. Smoking on water like in Futurama. Bender's a cigar underwater. Burns Zoyberg's home. <laughs> Forgot about that. Thanks, man. Further questions. What can I? I like the new dress. What about the? I like the. Well, it's. There's the ashtray, right? I like the... Well. Man, that ash. Once you got used. <sighs> uh huh. There's a book on the opposite direction. Nice. It just, it either goes off the edge of the world or up to that crane that I can move around. I don't want to bust all that. Man, that act. Once you go. Mm. I don't want. I think I'd try. I don't know what else I can do with Mitch right hey, now. About ready. I will Listen. Many. That's it. We'll talk to her later. But I will save here. Yeah. Ah, this puzzle. You can say that at every part of this game. <laughs> Come on. Get, get in there. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. It's, time, it's a timing thing. Oh. Do you have to use the ashtray when she's not? It does involve... Oh. What part of that even looks like a puzzle? Yeah. Man, that act once you So when do I Just take a break. I'll take a break. She just turns it back. I've never this time area. This whole area is kinda weird. Um I don't know if there's any way to just... Hey, about that. Ready. I no. Listen. Many. I like them. Where? I'm trying to... I like... Where? What the... Man. What? Time closer to when she's gonna flick it? When does she flick it? Man. Once... Okay. So she... Grab. And she, there's not really a pattern. She just kind of does stuff. You got this first try. I'm not even sure what I'm trying to do. For me. What if? Oh, of uh, the um, <laughs> the speed at which you're working. That's nice, Manny, but you're not my boss, so really I couldn't care less. Yeah, that's Good. a little bit of ankle Excellent. bone. Carry on. Yo, is that tibia amphibia going all the way up? It's empty. Our type of business. It's empty. Our you know, a little clear nail polish would fix these right up. Free spirit lady, thank you. You have to sub the berries cute. How dare you? Thank you. These are too nice for that. To to give back to her? These are too nice what? for that. What? These are too nice for that. Why don't you... 
These are too. These are. Why would, trying to. These are too. That gesture might confuse her. It confuses me. Okay, that. Okay. That was with the ashtray. Uh. Madalingus, thanks for the raid. Welcome. Stocking's best friend. And who's driving the car? Welcome. We're playing Grim Fandango. Hope you're all doing good. Not picking that up. Ba -da -ba -da -ba -da -ba. We're in year three, if that means anything to you. Currently trying to get the hell off an island. What? I probably don't know what I need the stockings for yet. That's just saving me a trip later. It's a good year. Let's, uh... Oh, hey, oh, thanks, Madeline. Just thanks for the raid and thank you for the bits. Um, you can just kind of. Hmm. They must bring the poor over here to be crushed. Either that, or these are the biggest, meanest-looking hair curlers I've ever seen. Mm-hmm. Those things are dangerous. I'd be ground to bits. How does nail polish fix stockings? Might be noticeable. I don't know. Hmm. Uh, should I be here now? <laughs> this feels like a bit of a dead end. Have all them memorized? I obviously won't say any. Appreciate it. I don't mind little nudges and hints, though in a situation where I'm just clearly confused, which is every puzzle. Hmm. This is a postcard. Well, welcome to the eighth underworld. We have sand and skeleton. Hmm. These things feel like I'm out past my bedtime and my parents are none the wiser. It's a very specific level of mischief. Talked some about stockings before. We talked about Meche. Oh, Chipito. Wanted to trade from. Do we, does he have anything else we want to trade? I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. Nah. Oh, does he have a gun? Hmm. So find out. He said he had a gun. Did he say he had a gun? I think I've already forgotten what he said. Nice. I know I, I, that I asked him about getting stockings and he was like, oh yeah, those are high ticket. So, fair. You couldn't afford it. That's what it was. Yeah. Ah, oh, sweet Mary. Yo, check this out, Chapito. Hey, Chappy. Check out the hosiery. Say, these are real silk. Where'd you find them? I've been wearing them the whole time. You too? Well then, here's your new best friend. Ah, my first Sproutella gun. Is it loaded? No. Hey, bullets are hard to get. Oh boy, a gun. Ah, my first Sproutella gun. Da -de -da -do -de -do. Time to do a murder. Ah, sweet Mary. I'm not taking that back. I thought I'd never unload that lemon. Hmm. Steal his look. You don't need bullets, do you? Those poor people Go to see Miss Liza. Oh, I can threaten the children with the gun. Let's do oh, that. Virginia. Oh, boy, oh, boy. Think of all the interactions we can do now that we have a gun. I bet they'll cry. <laughs> Hey, thank you. Welcome back. Hey, kids. How y'all doing? Check this out. Oh, there you go. Too easy. <laughs> Manny? Too easy. Why? Too easy. Why? Never mind. Um. Wrong, wrong thing. Let's put that away. There you go. Check this out. It's really not much use without bullets. It's really not much I'm use without to... bullets. 
Can I, can I look at her with it? It's really not my. There you go. Here, what good's a relationship without trust? True, a relationship without trust is about as empty as a gun without bullets. Guess you didn't realize a smart girl always keeps an extra round in her hat for mad days. Come on, let's go. Mitchie, you don't know what you. I know exactly what I'm doing. Now move! Mitchie! Would you just listen to my escape plan first? Trouble in paradise, kids. You're letting us go right now, or your boy Friday here gets it. Well, I hate to see you go, Manny, but uh, the lady seems to have made up her mind. I'm serious. I'll shoot him. Fine. He really doesn't work for me anyway. But I thought he... I'll shoot you then. No, you won't. You're too good, remember? I'm not. I'm not good anymore. You've taken that out of me, keeping me a prisoner here. I'm gonna crack you open like a fake thing, Bob. I'm gonna... <sighs> Kid's all right. <laughs> She's a firecracker. But a night in the cooler usually dampens her fuse. Cool. Good talk, then. Um... Well... That went well. Man, that ashtray's so fancy you could children's books. It's locked. So, so where where is she now? I think I'm oh. running out of air. Hmm. Must be a combination lock, but there are no Baby. numbers. Maybe. Poor Don was never good with numbers. Mm-hmm. Hey. Uh. I'm in here. Yeah. Let me out! No. Hey! Yeah, maybe, yeah, I was about to say, maybe we can just bust it. Who needs I a combination? I won't pull guns on anyone anymore! I don't want to mess up the Hi, wheel. Z. The wheel's my friend. What? Must be a combination. Poor dog. I'm warning All right. you, Domino! Time for the old scythe trick. Picking a lock. Hi. I don't want to mess up my blade. Yeah, I'm not. My side. My 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 This is my my Okay. I'm He's just a angry. fan of rats is all. Maybe the kids can bust her out. Hey, guess what? How are my brave little soldiers? Are you here to rescue us? I'm working on it. New plan. Mitch is locked up for good. We're leaving without her. We can't, we can't leave, leave without Mitch. <laughs> you children just wait here and be brave little angelitos, okay? Okay. I knew that would cheer them up. <laughs> I like how he's not like, oh, we gotta bust her out. He's like, well, new plan. She's locked up for good. It's like he's trying to make Last them chance. cry. It's like, dance. go get her. <laughs> go get her out. Right. Stay in there. He is mean. Uh, she didn't pull a gun on him. Yeah, that's true. That's a little bit of overkill considering it's not locked. Hey, kiddles, check out my bone saw. I don't know. I try and I try and I just get nothing out of them. They just hate me. I don't know what it is. It's the damnedest thing. Um. Hmm. Chapito got anything else? Bloody daddy dada. Chapito. Ah! Quit ya! The door again? Oh, is there more on the door? Well, you don't. Cool. Doors have multiple parts. Next, you'll tell me that currency can be exchanged for goods and services, chat. Come on. Be reasonable. I'm getting angry! They should open it. What? Oh, there sure is a handle. Hey! I guess I didn't enter the right combination. I'm Ooh, getting I bet angry. I could pick that. If only I hadn't lost my union card in that poker game. Open this. 
Ooh, I bet I could pick that. Bust if only the, the I had hinge. lost my union card in that portal. Bust the hinge. There you go. I'm getting angry. There you go. Manny, where are you? Must have hit a major circuit. Hmm. But it looks like I've exposed the guts here. Hmm. Currency isn't real since we got the gold standard. You're right. I can't move those by hand. I need this wheel. Those are the tumblers of the combination lock. I can't move those by I, hand. I know. I I'm trying to use the wheel. Um. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Wait. What if you. How about you. What if you. Like that? And then. Like that? Oh. And then. Bazinga. What? And then. Like, like, just like that. Now do it. I guess I didn't enter Fuck. the right common name. Or do I? Did I do it the wrong way? And I want them like. Yeah, his hands just kind of, you know, slapping at it. Do I need to be like this, this way? Oh, there's like, yeah. Fuck. Wrong side. Okay. So there we hit just 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 slap it a little bit, me. Just a little bit of, and then oh, oh when the get, try that. Come on. Fuck. What? Oh, when I had them so nicely lined up and everything. I sure did. What the hell? So I got into a school locker? Yeah. Just kind of, just with your open palm, just kind of wiggle it around. Well, if it's not that way and it's not that way, then which way is it? Um. Or did I just not do it good enough? TM. Uh. Uh. Oh. Uh. Gary's <laughs> Exactly. What am I doing wrong, chat? I don't know. Yeah. 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 Maybe I gotta wedge my scythe in there. My scythe. My scythe. Mice. 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 Get that in there. There you go. Stay. There you go. Now that's an intuitive puzzle right there. <laughs> Jesus. Oh, I seem to remember right, that a Mitchie, little bit. You can come out now. Meche? Me Meche? Hmm, some sort of metal contact. Am I about to get locked in here? Hmm, no. Electrical current makes my marrow tingle. That sounds fun. Boy, the bus stall and I really did a number on that door. Why would you, why would you? Uh oh, oh, Raul. I am so, so sorry. Why would you do that, Manny? Why would you do that? I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this side. Meche? This must be the big chipper. Oh. What the? It's a cosa is heavy. Hmm. Man, people in the old days were huge. Mechi, are you in there? It's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. Looks like years and years of coral harvest reports. This can't hey, be what this secret safe is meant to hold. They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. Mm -hmm. Looks like years. This looks like this. Mm -hmm. Harry Housens with that axe. Uh, right in the middle. Jackpot. Nope. Hint, not yet. I gotta bring this somewheres. Spin. Yeah, I'll spin.
Can I get him with it? Uh, put it right on his toesies. So long, Gibbowser. No, he's not really a detective. He's more of a sales agent. Maybe I'll find the hollow point by dragging it around and listening for a different sound effect. Right? Huh? Sales agent, restaurant manager, boat captain. Yep, those are his skills. And now, slave labor manager? Hmm. Game gets mixed up with Detective Grimoire. Both Grim. Uh, Child Frightener, yeah. Crooked Casino, not a restaurant. True. Now he's on the door? I don't think so. It's just labor manager, no need to be redundant. Fair. Damn. Yep. Cause it just slams on the ground, so that's why I'm like, I think you slam something on the ground. But. Huh. I might need a, a little, a little hint. Unless. 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 I think that would just bring the whole ugly thing crashing down on me. Oh, Manny? Ha! Bust all my ass. Damn it. Also, bust all my ass does sound like a euphemism. Ha! Bust all my ass. I know. This is the time for my sight. Don't need to deal with the axe yet. Okay. So I'm remembering things in the wrong order, as is my specialty. There it is. Manny, I knew you would. Why is that door closed? Uh, it was the only way I, uh, uh the wind? Oh. You gotta connect the current with your metal sight. Don't worry about it. What is plot? We're on an island on the end of the world, trying to get off it. That's the simplest version of what's happening hey, right now. Hey, this is my room. Go use up the air in your own room. Damn it, think about that. We did spend like half an hour underwater and it was fine. That home plumbing sprinkler system looks like it's about to fall apart. I can't reach that high. Hmm. Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. Touch it. I touch it and I'll touch it again. What's in these cases? Take a look. It's all the double end tickets Hector and Dama have stolen over the years. Each one stolen from a good soul, and now they just sit there. That's it. What? They just sit there. That's what's been bothering me. In the days when I was a hot salesman, I used to see double end tickets all the time, and they move. What do you mean they move? They become agitated around human souls, and the ticket that belongs to you will actually fly into your hand. But these tickets, and the tickets in that suitcase of Charlie's, it's like they're dead. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double end tickets? Hmm. 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 Doesn't look like she's cooled off yet. Thanks for not shooting me. Look. I'm sorry. I should have trusted you. It's just that the past two years have been pretty tough, you know? Yeah. Yeah, I know. Oh. Um. You look like you could use a nice ocean cruise. Still my travel agent, eh? You look like you- Still my- Hmm. Hmm. Well, now I can grab this. I should have shot you, right? That's what friends do. Touch it again. I'm gonna keep touching it. Yeah. Hold on. I gotta... I gotta do a murder. That one's a different color. Okay, that's not it. Is Onsta still around? Hi, Killy. God damn it. Killy. Okay, hold on, hold on. 
uh, Friday night starts playing. <laughs> uh, I'll send it to her. God damn it. Fucking shit. Give me a sec. All right. Um. Hold on, Meche. I'm solving a puzzle. This is what puzzle solving looks like sometimes. None of them sound different. I've personally died. Hi, Owens. Welcome back. Hmm. Maybe she can help you. That'd be nice. Oh, hey, I got lucky. <laughs> cool. Uh-oh. That's yeah, fine. After you. What about the suitcases? Forget them. They're counterfeit. They wouldn't fit through this hole anyway. Let's go. How did we... Okay, you get the kids, and I'll meet you back here with the boat. What boat? Well, I'm working on that. Okay, Manny. Hmm. Where am I going to get a boat? I bet Gladys would know. No, Gladys. I miss Gladys. Every day, I remember his big yelling mouth. What happened to the boy? He got uh, pushed out of a window by Domino, and he fell off the edge of the world. Hmm. Is this Riven, right? Hmm. Yeah, it's right there. Can you go to that middle bit? I don't know if I can go to the middle bit. I will save though. Also, if you look on the save, the um the background mural progresses depending on how far in the game you are. Which is a cute little touch. So yeah, we're about three quarters through. You dead glass. I missed two steps. Yeah, what's the intended solution? Because <laughs> I remember slamming it down to open up a tile, but I clearly missed some steps. You can keep going, but it seems to be a dead end, right? I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. Yeah. I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. Can't be done. You can keep going, but it goes off to the edge, and then he's not happy about it. Can't seem to adjust the crane right now. You turn on the water, and when you turn it off, it drains away. Oh, okay. Don't know what's the crane. Yeah, it's fine. Drop the chain, maybe. Is there a way to? Back up, I go. Let me try again. You can drop the crane. Oh, ah, shit. No. Um, operate up and down. Oh. I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. Yeah, I, yeah, you're fine. What? Did I? I can't get out of here. There's no Did ladder. I break it? I think I broke it a little, just a little bit. Just a little bit. That's not, no, that's not where I am. I think I, I, I thought I had to run up the stairs and it immediately loaded me onto the crane and I immediately got off it. I think I just broke something. Yeah, I literally just saved. It's a good time. Try this again. Appreciate it was solved without flooding the room. You know, the password doesn't work. Yeah, no, agreed. Okay. Can't reach it. Hmm. Hmm. Hmm.
Mhm. Uh huh. And what does that do for me? Patch incoming. <laughs> Game's like six years old. The remaster. It's already quite old. Um. Maybe I have to bust it. Some kind of crusher device. It's not a handheld device. This coop looks heavier than my last ship. Busted. How did he not just get? I can see why they don't give these chisels to the new guys. You think that chain would have just fucking annihilated him, but. Okay, so, so now what? <laughs> it's not a hand. This coop look. N why did I do this? <laughs> there he is! Where's the boat? Miss Colomar said we're going to ride in a boat. She said you were getting one. Well, I. Children, be patient. Mr. Calavera is a nice man and he's trying to find us a boat right now, okay? It won't be that long now, I promise. Okay. okay. Why would cutting the descended Whee! chain cause it to violently explode? Good question. <laughs> yeah, there you go. Whoa! They're not crying. Tag, it. <laughs> it's not the same when they're happy. I swear I'll get us a boat. We know, man. Tag, wow. you're it. I don't think I've ever seen her in the sun before. It is a bus stop. Does what it says on the tin. Threaten them with the bone saw for old time's sake. Yeah. Um. Hey, children can be happy? What the concept? So I hop back in here. Oh, oh he, he was zooming. What? Now, I didn't even intentionally do that. Maybe I gotta lower the train onto lo lower the chain onto this. There you go. But that's wrong. I gotta get that going the opposite direction. Hmm. Gotta flip it and reverse it. Thank God he can walk on it when it's going the wrong direction. This would be impossible otherwise. Kinda wish Minnie really was only just interested in helping her because she deserves help. Yeah, I don't disagree. Um, I'm gonna save again. Not picking that up. It does feel a little bit weird. It fits in again with like the film noir inspirations. It's always about getting the girl. Um, but yeah, the fact that like it seems like it's just altruistic, and then at this point in the game, he's like, she's actually pretty hot though. It's like, feels a little bit weird. That's not, that's not where I, I must have moved the pixel over. You gotta get the goil, Manny. You gotta get the goil and save the world. Okay, okay. Using the D-pad is a little more reliable. There we go. That's more like it. Sure do. Uh oh. But now I can use the chain. Or something. Hey, boy angry. Seems a little sketch. Off the edge of the world. Huh? When did that happen? What? When did? How did? How did that happen? Before you got here. But it looks like it's attached to the chain. Also, it's Gladys. He's alive. Gladys, you're okay. Well, it hurt a little when I hit, 
but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, Carnal, I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. Listen. The drop anchor still fall off. Right. I ask you, is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh, yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good, too. Well. That's as close to the edge as I want to be. I think this baby... Oh, yeah, I was just... Mm-hmm. So good to see him again. He's good to see him. He's still in his little sailor suit. So... Um... I guess we That's just leave as it close to, to the edge as I want to be. I, yeah, I guess I guess, I guess it, it magically hooked on, so we can raise it up now. And he did say that the old hook thing it was holding on to was uh, heavier than our old ship, which justifies this crane being able to lift all this weight. Also, yeah, that is very much an anchor hooked on there, so it just. So, which so happens to work out. 87 McKean. Okay. Alright. Lift it up. This is gonna be fine. This is gonna be fine. Whoop. Oh. Okay, well. I was, see here I was like, it's weird that it's just automatically attached. Meanwhile, it wasn't actually attached. <laughs> So how do I hook it? Uh, no, 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 no. But buddy, buddy, get back on there. My sight, my sight, my my. There's an anchor there, but I don't know if I can interact with it. You could always go down. Just never did. Maybe. Yeah, I can't interact with stuff. Um, I just want to interact with it, Manny. Just want to look at it. That's not going to be as easy to climb up. Right. Almost got it. Um. Hmm. That just. I use the belt reverse, and that just pulls up the chain. Um, there has to be a way to attach it. Not right now. Hmm. There's got to be something I do while I'm down here. But if I so much as look at it, it just climbs back up. Just drop it into the abyss. What if I just uh, fuck it up? Nope. Pull a chain up with the belt so the end touches the anchor. I don't have control over when it stops, to my knowledge. Move the crane while it's down there. Now you're being smart. Not the crane. Play around with the lever. Oh. Because that wouldn't pull it as much. Oh, that's smart. In here? I know. Well, it's not me being the smart one. So that just makes it a big jumbled mess. And then lower it back down. Now that's a big jumbled mess. Beautiful. Now we can... <laughs> we got lucky with those physics, huh? All right. <laughs> I, that is coming back to me now. Oh, man. It's goofy. Yep. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Yeah, that's stable. Dude hasn't breathed in weeks. Galatis, I'm so glad to see you. Aww. I can't believe you got it to float. That was the easy part. The trick's gonna be busting through that big coral reef out there. Bust through a big coral reef, eh? Okay, give me a minute or two. Yeah, yeah, that's all I need. <laughs> nice to see him above ground again. Think of a way to get through that reef yet? No. Did you? <laughs> no. I can't build without the others. Man, was that ever hard to launch. 
Why can't I look at Mitch? Nice to see. No. Let's save the game. Man, somebody that can shoot through coral? Where would we find that? Oh wait. Those things are dangerous. I'd be ground to bits. Hmm. 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 Yeah. Oh yeah, this will do just fine. It works. All right, we're good. Easy. Works like crazy. Full speed ahead. Apparently, we freed some of the fighters too. He's what? listening to the OST. Oh. So, are you really going to bring me back and try to get your old job again? There's no job for me now except to bring you and everyone else here to the end of the road. But if you aren't going to use me to get your job back, why did you spend all this time trying to find me? Meche? I... I needed to find you. I give you one job, Manny! And look at you! Already screwing it up! Oh, hell yeah. We're fighting. I suppose you realize that this is gonna go down on your permanent record. Um... That's the squishiest looking periscope I've ever seen. Hmm. Hey, pull over, Octopus. You're going too fast. Um... Domino's just the kind of guy to practice Oxford regulation boxing and then pull out a blade when it comes time to fight. Shit. I don't think my bare hands would be a match with that scythe of his. Then is it scythe against... I lost my bust all. Scythe against scythe. Let's go. Mice. 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 <laughs> That's the squishiest what? looking... My scythe. My... 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 Alright, let's go. Let's fight him. Shit, we're not a good, <laughs> not good at fighting. Woo! This doesn't look good for the kid. Look, Dom, I'm not gonna work for you. Oh, don't worry about that. You're fired. Just consider this your severance. No, I get it. What if we, uh... Oh, there goes the octopus. I don't believe you, Calavera. You're losing a fight, so you pick on one of my pets? Why aren't you more like me, Manny? I've been trying to show you how, but you don't listen. If you just adopt the proper attitude, just look what could happen to you. Yeah, he's really dead. <laughs> oh, is there more dialogue if you just keep fighting him? Oh. My bad. We can maybe save and then load a save. Anyway, we walked across the frozen sea for a year. Yeah, he can get ground in the dust. Name. Pugsy Poligiano, sir. Hmm. Waiting room number two. Next. Uh... Glorious! Glorious! Is that the name? Yeah, no, he's fine. Glorious? Where'd you go this time? Hmm. Yeah, I'm sure he's fine. Let me, uh, save our slot three. Load back up this. I kind of want to see what the dialogue is while you're fighting. It'll just take a sec. 
Don't worry about glass. He's fine. He needs an engine. He really does. If he's not near cars, he'll die, remember? Hang it up. Okay. Yep. Yep. All right. I know it's different dialogue here. Look down. Oh, just can get him again. What are you doing away from your desk anyway? I'm sending this domino back to the bone pile. Yeah, get him. Smart strategy. Always let your boss win. You know, your name is Domino, but you're really just a pawn. Please, save the comic book one-liners for when you're winning. That doesn't quite work, either. Just like with your selling, Manny, you got a weak attack and no follow-through. The ah. is up. Hey, I'll stop any time you get tired. Oh, damn. He's got the moves. Oops. Didn't think there was dog. I was trying to hit him again. At least at the Christmas party, you passed out before you really got hurt. Had enough? No. Not until I've exhausted all of your dialogue. Manny, stop showing off for the girl. I got an achievement for that. Maybe that's all this dialogue then. Nope. Yep, might be. Yeah, bone pile works. Alright. Well, that was fun. <laughs> anyway. Uh, uh, let me get cop alerts real quick. Give me a second here. Uh, where did I leave off? Uh, Low Wolf, thanks for 47 months. Got a bone to pick with you, JK. It's only my monthly rent. Hey, thanks. First Stir, thanks for 33 months. I was always curious about this game after seeing it for free on Game Pass. Definitely a charming game from what I can see. Have a good one. Highly recommend it if you're in this kind of game. Just maybe. Use a hint guide. Just you might need a little nudge every now and then. Uh, thank you very much. Smash Brothers for 10 bits about the voice actor for one of the boys in the cage. KOKO -K -O with 23 months. The time flies. Have fun doing the Fandango. We will do the Fandango. Spooky, thanks for 56 months. Project RF, 18 months. Jump up on the Hydra's back. Enjoy your very mild curse scout the key. Manic, thanks for the 10 bits. Ophaloaf with 69 bits. That just raises further questions. Pretty spirit lady, thank you for gifting us sub to Barry's Cute. Uh, Madalingus, thanks again for the raid and the 100 bits. Lord La Lavatane, thanks for the prime. Welcome, enjoy the emotes, including Bar Eh, which we have for Grim Fending. I mean, normally it's just me, but special Manny edition. Uri the Burb, thanks for six months, enjoy your golden key. Six months already. Brock, thanks for 30 months, enjoy your outhouse key. Smooth Fanny, let's go Manny. And Boingri, thanks for 13 months. Welcome uh, back. Yeah, thank you. Uh, man. All right, what are, we, what are we doing? What are we doing here? Where'd Gladys go? Oh, Gladys would love these. Hmm. That's the road we came in on. Nothing out there but snow and a perfectly good pair of sunglasses. Oh, no. Hello. Wow, no echo. We truly are at the edge of the world. A different edge. Two different bars. It's just the one. Hello. Hmm. Wow. We truly. You may need a refresh. Well, I mean, look, we're in a new year. So. Did it, did it update on, on the stream? Yeah, it updated on the stream. Yeah. Look, he's got a new. He's got a new costume. Thanks, Duke. Appreciate it. Bruno. Bruno Martinez. You. You were the guy who packed me in there. You could have at least given me a magazine. Four years with nothing to read but this damn mug. What are you doing here? 
And if you were headed this way, why didn't you offer me a lift? Ah! Wait, I'm getting out of here. This world's for suckers. Yeah, I don't really blame them. What's in the mug? Thought it was empty when we gave it to him. It's the mug I gave Bruno, and it's full of that foam I packed him in. Oh, it's foam. Phew. I drink it, but I don't want to get a packing foam mustache. Why not? Sheesh. Ugh. This is the first day of the rest of your life. Yeah. There's some packing foam in here with a Bruno-shaped dent in it. I already got a mug full of that stuff. Hello? It's full of caskets. Hello? 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 It's full of cat. Hmm. All right. Nothing in the cab but donut boxes and coffee to go cups. Locked. Probably to keep out the Yeti. The Yeti. Forbidden marshmallow. Manny! What's wrong? Go up there and see! Hey, where is everybody? Waiting area two. How long do they have to wait in there? Until they have tickets. They were issued tickets on the number nine, and they don't have them now. The punishment for selling double-end tickets is very severe. But they didn't sell their tickets. Their tickets were stolen. By who? Hector Lehmann stole them to sell to rich people who don't deserve them. That might be them now. Let's see just what they deserve. Like the bones on the railroad sign. Hey, it's lawyer guy. For guy's name again. Wait, uh, Nick. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Straight the hell. Well, that's elaborate. Huh. It looks a little ungainly, but I bet that hat is really warm. What happened to that train? Your destiny cannot be purchased. I know this Final Fantasy boss. Yeah, the train demon. I don't understand. Why has everyone been detained? Given a ticket, a soul may not sell it. They didn't sell their tickets. Someone else is trying to. Bring the tickets. That is all. The tickets are in Elmaro. How can I get there quickly? These rails are already there. Well, thanks for the help. The gate opens. The gate closes. It does not help. Though, so, all right. God damn it, buddy. Really? Oh, not again. Hey. How'd you get free? I was born free, Boatnik. Nobody gave me no ticket, so nobody can take it away. So what are you pacing around here for? Trying to unwind a little bit. All those years circling in one direction. Gotta even out my life in this world before I go on to the next, you know? Well, that ought to do her. Ah, uh, Chapito's great. Goodbye, Chapito. Happy trails, Captain. And thanks for setting me straight back there in the drink. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna let it shine. See you later, Chapito. He's off to the next one. I like how there's no real pomp and circumstance. He just goes walking off, and that's it. Well. Um. Recently, I was visited by a bird with a human head. Do you know such a bird, Manuel Calavera? No. How do you know my... He knew you, and for you, he left this. Why note. did he say that so weird? Oh, thank you. Look at the murals. Oh. I know what you're up to. I've been watching. Stay there. I'm coming to sprout you myself. Yours truly, Hector Lemans. Híjole. Hmm. Well. I know what I've been. Your. Okay. There's meals in here we can look at. Oh. 
Um, I don't know if I can interact with them, but we can look at them from afar. They look real cool. Wow. Wow. This mural has all the stuff we didn't put in the brochures. I don't need a map now. I'm here. It's a big map. Hmm. Is there anything else I can do with them? Was it you that made that switch point straight down? The living train does what it does. Hmm. I get the feeling that operating that switch is out of my powers. I don't know if I can go over the tunnel. Or can I? S see you later. I could actually do it. I could walk out of this world right now and not look back. But I can't. I can't do it. I'm not leaving without the people I promised to save. Oh, Manny. What about this time, though? I'm not leaving. Okay. <laughs> if you do the same thing, it's like, ah, screw it, and the credits roll. He's grown. He's a big boy. Maybe just one more time. Right. Glottis. Hear the name of the Great One. Glottis. What's happening? How many days has this Grand Demon gone without driving? Well, we've been hiking for months. Months? Months? Oh, then the Noble One will surely die. But... Glottis, no. I think that's what Glottis would look like if he hadn't drunk his milk growing up. He's just a little guy. What's wrong with him? Do you not know the one purpose, the one skill, the one desire of this humble spirit? Yes, but we've been so far away from cars and civilization for so long. Why, why did he ever leave his home? I, uh, I got him fired and then uh, I needed a ride. Oh, Gladys, what have I done to you? Can you cure him? His spirit has fallen so low, normal driving would not cure him in time. He needs to go faster. <laughs> faster! The only way to save Gladys is to go fast. Do you have any vehicles here that we could use to revive him? Only the trucks that deliver the souls. But they are slow. So slow. Who are you guys? We are mechanics. Same as he. But we have never before seen one of our kind, so... So large. I've got to go see what I can do. Come back quickly, for his time here is not long. He's a real big mechanic demon. How did I not notice this was happening to Gladys? Gladys, I'm sorry. Manny. Why didn't you tell me you were sick? Couldn't stop. Have to save everyone. Are you in much pain, my friend? Only because I let you down, Manny. Glad! What can I get you? Will anything help? I need to race to fly like, like the old days, Manny. In the bone wagon. But the bone wagon's not here, carnal. Maybe I'll see her on the other side. This is the other side. Can't we make a new hot rod? Those days are done, Manny. <laughs> No more hot ra- Hey, what's that red thing? The gondola? Mm, sweet decal work. Listen, fellas, somebody, somebody get a pen. There it is, my final work. It could save me if you have the right, <coughs> the right, <coughs> you what fuel, Gladys? Gladys! How did I not notice this? It looks like blueprints for a rocket sled. They're brilliant. It looks like blue. They're br He's a genius. I wonder if she blames me. Meche, we have to get back to Omaro for the tickets. Oh, Gladys. It looks like they're br- mm -hmm. It looks like they're br- Gladys, what fuel? Oh. Oh. 
How did I not? Hmm. Hey, how about a gondola ride, Gremlins? He's too big. The gondola is too slow. Hmm. Gondolas? I knew we should have checked this side of the mountain before we walked up. <laughs> mm hmm. Hmm. Little we'll break room. It's closed. It's full of rags. It's full of rags. Get one. Always a good idea to have a clean rag around. It's a lovely rag. Mm hmm. There's a note next to this toaster. To avoid further mishaps, please butter your English muffins after you toast them. Facilities. That's good advice. I already have a rag I don't know what to do with. <laughs> <laughs> That's adventure games. Uh. Your mother doesn't work here. Since nobody listened to my last warning about keeping this refrigerator clean, I'm afraid I'm going to have to lock it until some of you grow up. Signed, the facilities department. Damn facilities. Your mother says I'm a sign. That's harsh. Well, it's good to know they recycle oil out here at the end of the world. My joints don't need any oiling right now. Mmm, bone oil. How you they lock up their tools just like Gladys. How you Mm-hmm. Oh, I got, yep. Got a little rag, got my scythe. Got this nonsense. That happened in my university dorm, still mad about it? That's messed up. Legit. I don't want to mess up my blade. Yeah, you never do. To know be... Uh. Is that shadow in the break room? Or something else? I think I want to just. Yeah, there you go. Yeah. This better not stay in my pocket. It's an oily rag that I made all by myself. Check out this oily rag, Gladys. Here, Carnal. Get away for this. <laughs> oh, that's nice. Make sure to lay some of those on my grave, <laughs> will you, Manny? No. <laughs> no. Here, Carnal. God damn it. Oh, make sure. Fuck. <laughs> it looks like bloop, they're bri- uh, It looks like they're- Does Meche want this? How did I not- I think that's what Gladys would- look Ah, the favorite perfume, but not enough to raise him from his gloom. Show him the mug. Check this out. Gladys. Wake up and look at this. He doesn't care. Gladys. He just doesn't care. That's no place to put a mug. Uh. Maybe I can s s put the uh, oil rag into the toaster and set this place on fire. Nope. Oh. Oh, I so I can. Yeah. Not again. Will they never learn? It was the little guy. I saw him. Ah, and he denied it the last time. <laughs> Don't try this at home. No. It was a good idea to have a clean rag around. So, so dip that in the things to start the fire, because the fire extinguisher. This better not stay in my pocket. Is what um, will explode with this. No, you cannot combine That's items. There's no place to put a mug. There you go. I hate it when people leave their crusty mugs out in the break room. There's a note next to this butter. Mm-hmm. 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 Are we gonna are we are we gonna explode the whole building now? Seems like a terrible idea. What was in that mug? 
Something that powerful could fuel a... A, a rocket. rocket! If only we had more! Well, I could score you a couple of truckloads if you're interested. We shoot you now like an arrow into the wind. May you pierce the heart of the wind itself and drink the blood of flight. Speed is the food of the great glasses. Speed bring you life. Come back to us someday. I like these little guys. Go fast, Gladys. We're going fast. Rocket-powered Gonda. Hope there's no trains on the tracks. Yeah, right? You sure this thing's going to hold together? Uh, at least most of the way. Hey, look! We're all ready to Rubacaba. Manny? Manny? Manny, where are you? Manny, I'm frightened! <laughs> Damn it, Gladys. <laughs> Shit. And back to the bottom of the sea. Hell. Ah, Rubicaba! What a town! Remember the glory days, Manny? Long gone, my friend. There's nothing here for us now. Except maybe our old car. Oh, shit. Dios mio! She's been... Booby trapped by who? <laughs> who? <laughs> it's a mystery. <laughs> oh man, there's so many dominoes everywhere. I just don't know. Those dominoes are like one long fuse. <laughs> we'll never know. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. I forgot about that bit. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes all right. tumbling. All right, all right. Poor guy, so nervous. I think he's gonna be sick. Don't panic. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. What a trooper. Looks like Domino left his calling card. But how? I saw him torn to shreds. He must have done this on his last trip through town. You really should get back in case it blows. I'm with you guys till the end. You know that. Hmm. You really should. I'm with. Don't panic. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Eh. Gonna go back over here to the racetrack. Maintenance has gotten pretty lax around here, apparently. Can't go there. Well. We're back in Rubicava after two long years away. Manuel Calavera? Ha <laughs> Well, what happened to the limbo? Hate to tell you, Velasco, but she went down at the Pearl. But we found a new ship, the SS La Mancha, and managed to... The La Mancha? My old rusty bucket. Where is she? Oh, well... We traded her in Puerto Zapato for a team of sled dogs. That does it. I'm out of this stinking mob town. But thanks for finding my baby, Manny. Puerto Zapato, here I come. Mob town? Eh, I'm sure it's just a figure of speech. You'd think after two years he'd have the little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on at least. Maybe I'll just finish this for him. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, oh, that looks great. <laughs> You'd think after two years, he'd have a little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on, at least. Oh, a flash mob town. Even better. It's locked. It shone pale as bone as I stood there alone. And I thought to myself how the moon that night cast its light on my heart's true delight. Oh, shit, the Lupe. Reef where her body was strewn. Ah, not quite the same without old Velasco. Yeah, right? How the fuck is Lupe doing? Hmm. Mm, not a good sign for Rubicaba's organized labor movement. Hello, Terry? Where they all go? He meant Mop Town because I can mop! I do like a good mop. It's a shame there's no rule of threes and that 
only twice do they have a transition where he goes from from mopping oh, to. Oh, I got an achievement for coming back. Oh, now I'm sad. Yeah. Oh. No bees. No sea bees. Yeah, I love that bit of just cut him mopping something. Fast forward a year and he's on top of the world. How's the blue casket doing in the interim? Oh. Um. Blue casket. I don't mess with Olivia's. Mm-hmm. Looks like it's open mic night. I, oh, it is. I mean, it's November second. I 2nd. just can't do it without an audience. Will I do? Olivia. Calavera, what are you doing? Did, did, was that here? the AIM open I heard noise? How and Zapato, Daddy. Well, Hector Lamont's tried and missed. Now it's my turn. I'm headed to El Maro to put him out of business. Manny, that place has changed. You don't know what you're getting into. I'd better come with you. Just give me a minute to get ready. Okay, but if you hear a loud explosion anytime soon, the trip's off. Hmm. Coffin shooter one, two, three, just pour, chill, and serve. I would, but I hate sucking gelatin straight from the tap. Uh-huh. They still haven't done these? I'm not gonna eat off of dirty plates, and I'm not going to clean them. Not to sound like a capitalist oppressor, but I have people who do that for me now. Yeah, man. Nothing in the dishwasher. Mm, okay. Can I crack that no. open? Okay. Uh, uh, that's all I got. All right. Hmm. As soon as I think of a use for stink. Olivia? Is it time to go yet? No. We're having a little car trouble. Come by when it's time. Okay. See you later. Uh. I guess we go up. Just a little bit bourgeois. The bottle? Was there a bottle in there? Uh. Uh. What bottle? What bot? What are we? Oh, the ship in a bottle. I didn't think about this as a receptacle for liquid. Feels kind of mean to uh, the old captain there. That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake ocean water. That's what the lumb. I drink it, but I probably get the SS lumbago stuck in my throat. Mm-hmm. How's it look now? Looks good. All those pixel art bubbles on there. Okay. Eat the ship. Delicious. Like drinking a bottle of Legos. It's locked. Oh. Due to the new curfew, elevator operation ceases at sunset. Curfew? Who's in charge of this place now? Hmm. Well, where else can I go then? Um. Uh. Wait. We can go back. No, not this way. Uh, this back south from where the bone wagon is was where, uh, whatchamacallit was. Not the morgue. The morgue is up above. But over here was uh, the, the tattoo parlor. Should still be here? Yeah. How's this guy doing? There he go. Mm-hmm. Mm hmm Doesn't hurt. Mm-hmm. I think these are binders of tattoo designs. They're labeled not I going am, nice, I am an and a third artist. one just says Anchormania. I don't want to wake up Toto. Yeah, uh, oh, me. I wonder if Inez has cooled off yet. Hello, operator. Your yeah, mother it's me, Manny. It. I was just passing through town and. 
Wow. He's still mad. He doesn't want to wake up Toto by picking up his book. Kill you. But he'll go on the phone just fine. Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, Manny. I was just passing through town and... Color wow. goes more. Still mad. Not my fault! What we got here? Liquid nitrogen. Oh. Not to be used on bone. Not my fault! There can't be too much in here. I better save it. Never get me under that thing. I don't want to wake up Toto. He's got some loud snores. Hold still! Oh, Toto's plum tuckered out. Oh, no. I don't want to disturb his grumpy little dreams. Mm hmm. I don't want to wake up Toto. Yeah. Yeah, there's no. F yeah. Uh, it's probably fine. It's the ladder I came in on. Well, we got liquid nitrogen. Will that help us to defuse a bomb? Or, uh. Or, uh. We could, uh. When you, uh. So you, um. Uh. But I, we also have booze that'll pass someone out. Who would that be for, though? Hey, check this out. I put his stomach through enough for a while. Okay. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. Freeze it. It would just evaporate. Shit. We cannot because we can't we take the elevator. There. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. Do we need to freeze anything? Oh, okay. all right, Manny. Hmm. 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 There's no one over here. The blue casket's a dead end. Liquefy the floor? Um. Oh. All right. That reminds me. In my brain. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. I'm not sitting. I don't really want. Is that not enough? I don't really. Hmm. The gate? Which gate? Class looks thirsty, right? Actually, is he actually thirsty? Hey, bud. What's that? It's, uh, lumbago lemonade. Try it. Hmm. Perkly little aperitif, actually. <laughs> yes, siree. Not bad tall. <laughs> Tell me where you got that right now! Olivia's kitchen. Lumbago lemonade! Manny, aren't we in a hurry? Don't worry. This won't take long. We're a good friend. Oh, my stomach don't stretch like it used to. Oh, Gladys. He's fine. He's okay. He looks like he's about to blow too. So what is that stuff they pack canned hams in anyway? <laughs> Damn it, Manny. So I had the right amount, I had the right fluid, but not the right quantity of fluid. He's fine. He's okay. Good show, my friend. You wouldn't happen to have a breath mint on you, I suppose. Um, this gate doesn't open. It's locked, but there's nothing up there anyway. That goes to the upper dock, but nothing's docked there now. I don't think we've ever been able to go up there, so... It's not gelling. It can't gel now. It got all nice and warm in my belly. Mm hmm I'm really not sticking my hand in there now. Man, it's all warm. If only we had a way to, uh, you know, cool it down. Hey, 
good idea. I bet I could keep it down now that it's cold. Just let me get across first, okay? Gladys, don't get off the floor. Ugh, the noises. Yeah. Yeah. Didn't knock down any dominoes, right? He's very talented. Soon to be known as the blown wagon. Hey, that's not funny. I'd better disarm her first. Eh, eh, eh. Fiendish. Well, here goes nothing. They really make you think it explodes with that cut. But we're good. Looks like Hector's taking over the whole town. He hasn't had much resistance. There's only one small group who oppose him, and they live out on the fringes of the city. Places like this, you mean? The resistance! I hope they're not hurting Gladys. Ha. Huh. Shows what you know about this group. Their leader is a great man who... Manuel Calavera, we meet again. I see you have found what you were looking for. I'm fortunate for you to arrive now just as we too are about to achieve success. Our army has grown, and right now our top agents are in Hector's weapons lab, about to close in on the enemy in his own den. I couldn't have done it without you, Manuel. It was a trap! Stand back. There's only one thing to do. <gasps> Thank you, sir. You have saved me. But more than that, you have enabled me to continue to serve the movement. What did you say about a trap? Hector uncovered our agent in his weapons lab. No. He's fine. You just gotta, you gotta stop the spread. You idiot, Bowsley. Your new lab assistant is a spy. Haven't you ever heard of a background check? <laughs> No time to explain. Now I'll have to take matters into my own hands. Take me with you. I've longed to be of service to your cause for years. I know, right? It's good looking footage. Why are plants weak to bone people? Uh, because plants are the opposite of bones. Or at least the opposite of death is life. It's the part of that soldier that didn't get up and hop out of here on one hand. Better save this part from sprouting. Yeah, just take his hand. It's the part of that soldier. No, it might come in handy. <laughs> Manny! Boo! It's the part of that the rest of him has gone to seed already. You ever seen playing with bones? Check me. Hey, Eva finally got that radio working. <laughs> calling all cars, calling all cars. Manuel, is everything okay? Uh, the, just testing the equipment, Sal. Salvador, maybe you should shut that thing off so we can talk. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. I take Mecha to all the best places. I bet the agent in this I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. <laughs> yep, he looks good. I take Okay, here's the plan. I need a disguise so I can get close to Hector and a gun. So we'll have something to talk about when I get there. If you figure out that part, I'll go find out where he is. His casino tower is directly above these headquarters. All uh, right, meet me there. That's convenient. Volunteers quickly for dangerous work. She could be very useful to the cause. As far as I'm concerned, she is the cause. <laughs> oh, man. I wonder if this is little Manny. Come here, little Manny. Ow! Hey, must be little Mitchy. <laughs> Who's the plant nut? That nut is Hector Lamont's personal munitions expert, Bowsley, a.k.a. the florist. That was his job in the old world, but here he's a botanical weapons expert. This has left him fairly conflicted. Why does he make Sproutella for Hector instead of our side? We've been trying to recruit him for years, but his lab is in Hector's tower. He's untouchable. Hmm. 
Hmm. Bet. Oop. Bet if I could get that plant lover out of there, I could talk him into making a gun for me instead. Hector, I almost have that new bouquet of tulips ready for you. Listen to me once and for all, Balsley. You are not a florist. You are a manufacturer of weapons. But I. There's the birds in the left. What? You talking about the bird up there? Memo to all agents. Priority urgent. In light of the recent disappearances, all agents are ordered to avoid travel in unlit areas until further notice. Memo. In all it It's my ex-boss's ex-secretary, Ava. You're never gonna let me forget the secretary thing, are you? Any messages for me? No. Nope. Call stopped coming for you the day you left. They're still sending you that lingerie catalog, though. Nice. Memo. In all it Hey. It Any messages? No. Nope. There's... All right. Salvador. Salvador? Hmm. Eh. Hello down there. <gasps> Ooh, never mind. Go back to sleep, whatever you are. Hello down there. Ooh, never mind. Ah. Go back to sleep. Gladys made noises over the punchline of that joke. You know, if I had had a car like yeah. this when I was alive. Things would have been different. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Okay. Not right now. Oh, man. I thought you could get through a video game without being run around the sewers. But nope. How about this one? Anyone down here? Monsters? Again? So many monsters. How about this one? Monsters? Uh. Okay, I don't know what's down there, but I have issues with it. <laughs> okay. My sight. I don't want to mess up my blade. Shrug. It. Oh. Oh, hey, there's a texture that's on top of Manny that shouldn't be. Devs, please patch. How do I get to that ladder? Oh, it's further forward than I thought. <laughs> Glass freaked out from an actual rocket car, but still is pretending to go for him. Yeah. Yeah, he's a good guy. Literally unplayable. Bleak horror adventure game. Yeah, pre ordered CG background's pretty unsettling when it's all rusted metal and pipes. Casino. Got to figure out some way to disguise this pretty face before I hit the streets. Mm, fair point. They do know what he looks like. Can I... Yeah. It's also pretty bleak. Yeah. Things are a bit bleak right now. It's not like Johnny Thunder lets just anybody in his review. No. I mean, being allowed to wear the Johnny Thunder makeup is an honor. Yes. A privilege. Yes. So I said to her, you give me that 10% discount or I'm taking my business elsewhere. You said that? Well, oh yes, I was mad, you know. And then, here's the good part. You don't say. Mmm, so show business coffee. So what did you... Well... Mmm, I'm just... I don't see any place to serve coffee here. Can I just... A little too hot for my pocket. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, all right. You guys want some coffee? Oh, coffee. Great. Hey, you want some coffee? There you go. Maybe I can put something in the coffee. Like, more coffee. You won't be expecting that. Cans won't count. Time we got a PA it here. might be. Hey, kid, keep it black and keep it coming, all right? Stick them up. This is a coffee robbery. Take all the coffee in the pot and no one gets hurt. What do I have? Uh, ladder? Night. Uh, some. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. Can't put that in there. Oh, bone. Put a bone in there. I think that would be disrespectful. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay. A nitro brew. Genius. Oh. The hell is that? 
This snowmaker is huge. Oh, it's a snowmaker. The grinder part looks handheld. Yeah, take that. Aha. Uh -huh. It's a handheld grinder. Well, didn't mean this to... This snowmaker is huge. Take... Oh. With the ice. And then grab it. You want you want bone snow? I don't know if we should put. No, no wait. Good night, Duke. Have a good one. Bone snow. Wow, that's not disrespectful. I think he'd be happy to know his body was serving the cause like this. Why would that? How does that help us? But for but for why? This snow make. I would, but it's full. Yeah, it sure is. I... How do I take it? <laughs> I keep trying to use it, but then using it just takes it. Uh... This snowmaker, this lever is attached to the fake snow supply. Yeah. This lever is... This snowmaker is huge. This snowmaker is huge. Isn't going to the coffee? Ooh. Put in the coffee. Pick up button. That's just the use button. I didn't realize that the B button was a separate pickup. Okay, well, I can make bone dust. How useful is it to make bone dust? Can I use the bone dust in the coffee? I think show people prefer it black. That's true. Hmm. Of course, as soon as I save up enough money for a double end ticket, I'm out of here. Hey, what? stoplight. You can't just buy a double N. Well, I know somebody who knows somebody who knows uh, Hector Lamas. Wow, you know everybody. But I guess so. Fair point. I should say. Hmm. Hey, out of the dressing room. We got all the Thunder Boys we need. Thunder Boys. Do I have every, everything I need to solve this puzzle? Maybe. Can I climb a ladder while holding a thing of coffee? Sure can. Wow, from up here, everybody looks like ants. My ants in particular. They wore so much makeup. Manny. Ah! Oh! oh, what did you do that for? I didn't, I... You melted my makeup. I can't go on like this. I took you under my wing, and this is how you pay me back. No, no, it's not like that. Great. And that helps me because... reasons. Hmm. Uh... It's a ladder. Sure is. Can I follow them? Sure can't. Hey, kid. This is your lucky day. We got an opening and you're How the would they know that already? in the Johnny Thunder Review. Yes, I've been working for this moment all my life. Then sit on down. We got to start your makeup. Now don't go too far. You never know what time is showtime around here. Oh, he looks good. Look at that chin. Oh my god. Um So now now we're Do I go back down? Oh, right, cuz there's that door of the casino. I don't have the right outfit though. Is that going to be a problem? I guess I only needed to worry about disguising my face. All my death. Alright. To the bathroom. To concoct my plan of taking a big poo. Alright. Hi, Calibio. I can't remember the last time I had access to a men's room. Good work, Vanny. Huh. Place looks good. I think this is his good side. Going up? This elevator goes up straight to the penthouse suite of Hector Lamans. Mr. Lamans, he only does the lot. business with the very select elite clientele. He even washed his hands? Nope. I'm also not entirely even sure what he did in there. Dude doesn't have organs. Um. Sir? Something strange is going on under that raincoat. Hey, what's going on under that raincoat? I don't know. What's going on under that makeup? A 
Agent Calavera. You? Didn't Salvador chop you in half early this evening? Yes, which has given me this glorious opportunity to serve the cause by gathering funds for the LSA while stealing from our arch enemy at the same time. Uh-huh. How's that going? What exactly are you doing with these slot machines? I'll stick myself inside like a finger down the throat of Hector Limons himself, and I'll make the machine regurgitate the wealth it has devoured. Yeah. Can you crack any machine? None of these unholy temples is safe from the LSA. Mira! Mm-hmm. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> oh. See you later, bud. This genius ploy. Can't believe he hasn't been caught yet. Can you crack any machine? None of these on mirror. It is a very white mirror. <laughs> mirror. You know the guy on the right? Yeah, he looks a little familiar, doesn't he? See you later. Can you crack? Oh. Mira. None of these. Are yeah. All right. Yeah, he's fine. I wonder if she's intrigued by my new jaw. Hola. Yeah, I think it's Charlie. From year two. No drinks for me, thanks. Okay. What's Chow Chilla Charlie doing here in Hector's casino? I knew that suitcase full of counterfeit tickets wasn't his. Buenos dias. Back off, sleaze ball, or my husband here will bust your jaw. Okay. Good to see you too, Meche. Pretty sure that's Meche. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the lam. Mm-hmm. So I think there's maybe an opportunity to do something while he's, uh, fucking with the machines. But to what end? No, but to what end? Uh... Is that... Is, is this... Is this of use? Why is... Why would I do this? Am I helping? Does this serve the cause? Uh, give me some bone juice. That's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. That's no way to treat an agent. That's no way. Right. Just a couple of bone chips. No item needed. Hmm. 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 Can you crack it? None of these mirror. Maybe what if I can I use the machine while he's I can't get close enough. That's one dedicated soldier. That's one dedicated soldier. Maybe I can pull soldier. the slot while he's doing stuff. This is where Hector rips off the people too poor to go upstairs. Hey, these work without money. Maybe Hector's not all that bad. Come on, big money, big money, big money. Hey! Oh, you're kidding me. It only pays off if you bet? That's not fair. Yeah, uh, that makes sense. This is where Hector... Did you miss a place around here? Possibly. Um... Where else could I go? Can't go left. Right is back where we came in from. Um... I can't go out through the right. Where else can I go? I don't know. Might need a... Might need a nudge. Hmm. Have a good one, Clarkson. Um... Someone said no item needed, but this seems like it'd be a useful item. This is something Never mind. I should keep to myself. The bone grinding thing somewhere else. Door where the light is to the right. I can't go out that way. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the lamp. Rig it to win on every free spin, then kill the odds for paid rolls. What well, nice, right? 
Yeah, Quacks, it's a great game. I just get stuck frequently because you're meant to take a while to get through it. And I'm trying That's to one dedicated do it quicker. Maybe, uh, maybe with the bouncer here. Hey, check this out. Impressed? You want some bone dust? Winning roll on the free spin. Hmm. This doesn't seem to do anything. It is, it seems immensely disrespectful to, um, fire this man's own ground-up hand dust at him. But, you know, Meche. What about her? You want some bone dust, madam? Meche, it's me. Manny? That's some costume. Uh, here, help me get Mr. God damn it. here into this sheet so we can get out of here. I all right. Um, just grab him. <laughs> hey, is that you, young lady? I'll get you. I'm going to punt this for the first chance I get. I'm going to. Okay. I wonder if she's intrigued by my new jaw. I'm going to punt. Mm -hmm. I'm going to. That didn't. Mm -hmm. Hey. Mhm. Mm God. Mhm. Mm Not funny. I it. They're all fixed. Oh. You must be patient, my kitten. Uh, I'll escort you to your party just as soon as my system pays off here. Mhm. Mm uh, why do you want to get him into a sheet? I told him there was a big toga party at the Casino Romano, but he had to wear this sheet to get in. After he changes, you take his suit and go upstairs. Get it? Sure. What if, what if we use it? Hmm, you're trickier than I thought. Mecha got this sheet for Charlie. We sit with her. I know this guy. He can play the slots for days. He said as soon as the machine pays off, he'll come with me. Mm. Here. No, I've tried already. It's your turn. Mm -hmm. Not again. I'll get you. Hey, you there. Not funny. Special assignment just in from Salvador. Ah. Crack that machine and leave the change right away. Yes, sir. There you go. Oh. Crying out loud. Get in there. God. It's our big slots. Ah. Young lady. Hey. Good work, soldier. Not funny. Help. This is a very good hat. I did it. My system worked. I knew it. I told you. That's great. Now let's go so you can buy me a drink at the Romano. I'll meet you at the train station with the tickets. There won't be one from me, so you'll have to go back by yourself. I'll tell that gatekeeper everything. He has to help us. Come, my lovely. I have another infallible system I'd like to demonstrate. Ow. Good. Time to take another massive bone shit. Hey, there you go. Tight in the shoulders, but at least it doesn't reek of sled dog. Yeah, that's us. Scouts don't look good in togas, huh? Yeah. I'm not going up there unarmed. Uh. uh I need. I need a gun. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the land. Wait, so where am I supposed to go? Can I get a gun in the sewers? I'm not putting those clothes back on. They stink. We need to get the flower man. Is there a path to him through the sewers? Use the bone grinder down here? Monsters do love ground up bones, right? Why wouldn't they? Or, 
Let's talk to Gladys. He won't recognize us. Not right now. No. Oh. You know. Fine. Ground of bones and baritone saxophones. Sounds like a Tom Waits album. Eh. Is that good? Hmm. You hungry? Okay. I don't know. Where do I do this? Too early. Oh, I have to actually go down in here. Okay. I don't. Okay. I feel like I'm missing something. This doesn't seem right. Huh. Try the middle one. What was the middle one? This way? I can't get in there. Uh. In the previous room. Okay. Anybody want some bones? Who's hungry for bones? I'm very confused. <laughs> Maybe this guy? Yeah. Fire through the grate. Hulk needs bones for his hands. Man, I don't know. Sup? Salvador, come in. Salvador? Any messages for me? Nope. There's still. Hmm. The central thing of that room? Grab a bone. It's got a lot of bone. Pigeon. Pigeon? Right, what? Because pigeons can go. They can just see someone's face. That was forever ago. Holy shit. Wait. Doing all the flowers. If I show him this photo, he'll fly off without anything to deliver. Oh, so I need him to deliver. Okay. All right. The bone. That doesn't, um, that doesn't do. Feed bones to the flowers in the war room. I don't know. Yeah, I don't know either. <laughs> the rest of him has gone to seed already. It's the part of that. S I'm immensely confused. Read the note. Yeah, I've had that letter for a while. I think this is... I know what you're up to. Mm -hmm. I've been watching. Mm -hmm. Stay there. I'm mm -hmm. coming to sprout you myself. Yours truly, Hector Lamont. Oh, is that what I'm delivering? To that guy? What are we done with the face paint so far? Not much. Okay, don't bite. This is a note. You like notes, remember? Uh-huh. And I'm having him send that to this guy? Well, here goes nothing. Why? <laughs> Go, baby! For la revolucion! For la revolucion. Just to freak him out. You will see. Yeah. <coughs> to me, a, a, a good puzzle doesn't have you solve it and go, Now what's What? Why did I do that? You know what I mean? But whatever. Oh, good. No, not baby Manny. <gasps> Thank you, Peanut. One of Hector's messengers. With a m m message for me? Yeah, he's dead in the florist's office. Right. See the... I know what you're up to. I've been watching. I'm coming to sprout you myself. George truly, Hector Lemans. I knew it. I knew he was out to get me the whole time. You'll never find my secret out at all. You're going to have to find yourself another florist. There you go.
That's... Okay. Holy shit. I remember now. Oh. Hey, bud. How you doing? Goddess? Give me that. <laughs> His vacant stare just going up and down. Not so high! Yeah, but you were doing this yourself! Watch the chrome! There's no pleasing you. Not so high! Holy shit, buddy. Watch the chrome! This remote control works the bone wagon suspension. No use for it. No use for it. Looks like Bowsley broke a canister of Sproutella when he landed. I hope he didn't drip any on himself. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. So lift that up. Not so high! You're just gonna have to deal right now, buddy. And then this is Shadow Glitch. With the with no with that with this. Hmm. There it is. The flakes of bone are sprouting when they hit the puddle and turning into baby tears. Mm hmm. So, he only could have gone this way, right? I saw Bowsley run down here. Where did he go? Um. There's nothing. Did he go this way? Yeah, he did. Okay, monsters. Okay. I think I could follow the trail this way, but I need a little light. There you go. Hey, what's that? That must be the floor's hideout. No, not that. The thing coming at us! What the? Oh, that thing. Um, I can't reach that high. I can just <laughs> hold on. Let me, uh, uh, yeah, it's a little Resident Evil now. Um, now I'm over here. Um, now, while he's occupied, we just get out of here, right? Oh, never mind. Uh, maybe, maybe back up. Maybe back up. Yeah, Gladys is fine. I'm not worried about him. How you doing? Um, the, the tail? Smash tail? How smash tail? It's a bone oh, because he's facing us now. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're right. And then... All right, now we're good. Just stay there, Gladys. You'd be fine, all right? Listen to the sound of my voice. You're gonna be okay, buddy. Don't worry about me. Hector? Looks like a big ball of tape Hector, is the jewel? Can't reach. Mm. That's the most gruesome the window display I've ever seen. That's I'm not touching any display. of these human remains. Hmm. I not touched. This human remains sane. I mean it. I'm not feeling too rosy. No, oh, I get it. At least he's I'm got some of the bodies on ice. I feel bodies on ice. <laughs> the king's responding to my internal monologue. I'm having. I feel. It's locked. There's other shot. Freshness counts. At least he's got some better. of them. It's locked. It's locked. Things are gonna change around here. There's other shot. Judging by the emblem. These cases yeah, are man. full of Sproutella. Yeah, the good stuff, too. None of that slow-acting fern food that I left for Hector. Fern food! Yeah, man. What's that? What are you doing? Are you crazy? Get back! Put your hands over your head! Put your head in your hands! Put your head in your lap! Ooh, ooh. Who do you think you're fooling? Mm -hmm. I love plants. Is that so wrong? I'm plants picking up are a lot beautiful. of anxiety here. You people! You think plants are death? Plants are life! You all! You are all death! Mm-hmm. 
It's not Do not descend! Listen, Bowsley, I'm not here to hurt you. Listen, Bowsley, I'm here to hurt you. It's not Hector, it's Manny Calavera. Look, I need a gun to put Hector out of business. Listen, I really need that gun. Listen, I re... Listen, I'm picking up Look, a lot of anxiety I need here. I need Hector! We're in business! Listen, I really need that gun. Plants are beautiful! Mm, murder? Good people! Do you think plants are dead? That soul has already been... I'm picking up a lot plants of anxiety here. What's that over the door? Oh, maybe I can use my scythe on death. the thing. Do you know the same? Mm. If people were plants, the world would be a better place. That is true. I could make everybody into plants. Okay, that's too much. Dial it back. Hey, do you know what you just did? You just opened Pandora's box. You get out of here right now or I'll let you have it. I'll... Hey there, stranger. Can I help you? Uh, uh, I'm looking for something in a 9 millimeter. Oh, well, I have a very pretty bouquet of that right here. Uh, uh, there you go. Would you like some baby's bread to go with that? Sure. All right. Here you go. No, thank you so much. You have a great day now. You too. Oh, free of charge. Thanks. Okay. Thanks, Gladys. This is my stop. That makes no sense. He was panicking, but making him think we were a normal customer made him relax. Can I talk? I want to talk to Gladys. What'd you do with the bell? I made him chill. I didn't do anything with the bell. I there was something covering the bell so it wouldn't ring, and I. Toss that off with the uh, the scythe. It's an adventure game. Listen, <laughs> not everything's gonna make sense. In fact, expect things to not make sense, and you'll be better off. All right, but now we can go up. It's a uh, little safe. Hey, what's up? Wait, so what we we got? We got a uh, got this and this and this. Hmm. This gun might actually look nice with a little baby's breath. Mm-hmm. Bowsley was right. This is the good stuff. No. This isn't ghost trick. <laughs> I'm here to conduct business with Hector Lamans. I just spoke with him on the phone and he's expecting me. You know Hector Lamans, huh? Hockey dokey. Then answer me this one simple question. Huh. Okay. How many days after each dental appointment does Hector Lamans floss his teeth? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. How long does this? How long does this? Uh, is, oh no. What? What kind of question is that? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I guess you don't know Hector Lamans like I know Hector Lamans. Uh, I think this is his good side. All right. Let's go, buddy. Huh. Okay. What is Hector Lamans' favorite prime number? Uh. Making up these questions. I'm sure it would seem that way to someone who three. doesn't know Hector Lamar. Just said three. You're right. All right. Let's go, buddy. What could he be looking at? Oh, right. Huh. Okay. Damn it. How many times has Hector Lamans unsuccessfully run for mayor? Yeah. What is he looking at? One. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I guess you don't. Alright. Huh. Okay. What are the odds in a million of Hector Lamans' slot machine paying out? Uh, uh, 32. 32? Oh, sorry. <laughs> I guess you don't know Hector. Mm hmm. Alright. Let's go, buddy. Huh. Okay, how many limos does Hector Lamans have in his garage? Yeah, well, so there's those numbers up there. But what, what, which one is he looking at? Well, now they're gone. And the board is changing each time. 
There's one new number each time? Oh no. One? Oh, so I guess you. Alright, let's go, buddy. That's just the number okay, seven. How many times? Seven. Seven. Oh, I guess. What? It was the only number on the board. What's he looking at? What's he looking at? The new number was 12. So it's. It's what. It's whatever the most recent, not when he comes up with the question. Right. Let's go, buddy. Huh. Okay, if okay. Hector Lamont's for driving a car 50 miles an hour, then what number am I thinking of right now? D 10. 10? Yeah, well, that was an easy one. Too bad, I win. Best two out of three. Don't mess with me. <laughs> I know Hector Lamont's. Oh, okay, all right. Okay, all right. Okay. I'll bet Hector pauses here every day and thinks to himself, boy, I wish I could see past my gut and enjoy my expensive monogrammed floor. Oh, shit. Oh, the disrespect. Oh, you ain't getting Oh. Oh, no. oh, Manny. Oh, Manny. Um. Looks like Celso found his wife after all. Oh, shit. So he did. Looks like Celso... Celso Flores, what are you doing in Hector Lemont's waiting room? Oh, he sent us out here to make up our minds about his offer. Who are you? If you don't mind me asking. Uh, ma, 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 ma. Is this your wife, Celso? Yes, we've just returned from a lovely cruise. Well, it became lovely once I caught up with you, my little tamale. Mm-hmm. Actually, I work for Hector. He sent me to answer your questions. Eh, uh, I'll handle this, my sweet one. What can you tell me about these double-end tickets? This price seems much more than double. Uh, it's a scam. The tickets are counterfeit. Take your money and run. They cost them because they save you a mint. Don't you feel that you're worth it? Need more help with your decision on your own. Um, yeah, it's a scam. It's a scam. The tickets are counterfeit. Take your money and run. Ho, ho, ho. Don't try any of that tricky reverse psychology on me, my friend. Mm. Well, they cost a mint because they save you a mint. Well, I don't have a mint, so what do I care? The real question is, don't you feel you're worth it? I know we're worth it, but are the tickets worth it? What exactly are you saving your money for? A rainy day? Because let me tell you, you're dead. Every day is rainy from now on. Yes, but there's no reason not to be careful with your money. Well, enough about you guys. Let me tell you about my problems. Actually, <laughs> we have a lot of talking we need to do, so... Hmm... I can actually... Okay. I can't raise my arms in this suit. Well, let's just hope no one pulls a gun on you tonight, huh? Is that foreshadowing? This makeup breathes about as much as vulcanized rubber. Yes, but it brings out your strong jaw. I just got back from the worst vacation I've ever had. Actually, I just got back from quite an adventure myself, so... Well, I'm sure you've seen flying spiders and flaming beavers, but trust me, it gets worse. You see, I've been to the edge of the world and back. I had no idea traveling the land of the dead was so fraught with peril. Now, how much would you pay just to skip the whole thing? Darling, come. Let us blow our nest egg together. Mr. Lamans, we've decided to take you up on your generous offer. Yeah, we're saying Excellent. the hell. Excellent. The little lady changed your mind, eh? No. Actually, it was your agent over there. I, 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 of course. He's one of my best. <laughs> well, come on in. Let's chat, shall we? Ah, still got it. Great. Still a piece of shit. I don't know who you are. And I don't know what spell you cast on the Flores couple, but stick around. Once I'm done with them, there's something across town I'd like to show you. Okay. Am I talking about just a job here, or am I talking about opportunity in the general sense? It's weird it's a human and not a skeleton. This office in the last couple of years, the and frankly, we've had trouble filling them. I could really use a closer like you on the team. Our old office. This could be your office. Well, there you go. 
Yeah, try this on. See how it feels. That's yours too. And as an added bonus, 2% of these, Mr. My name's Calavera, and I want a bigger cut. <laughs> oh, Mr. Calavera, I'm going to need most of these to get myself out of this world. You see, I've been a very bad boy. <laughs> I'm going to deliver those tickets to their rightful owners, and I'm going to deliver you to the compost pile. Oh, shit. Don't waste your bullets. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, he shot a bird. Well. All right. We're the good guy, though. I swear. I don't know, Pariah. Good luck. Oh, no. The leg's broken. Oh, well. Guess he's dead. Sure is, um... A leg of... Guess that was a one-leg trip. I... Be... What? When... If the shoe fits... Got a leg up on him. Cause... He's one- looks like he's one foot in the grave. That's pretty good. Got him one. <laughs> uh, Doug Pyrimidone, thanks for seven months. Hope the sub helps Gladys. It did. And thank you. And then thanks Stoplight for the raid. Welcome. Couldn't- looks like he couldn't quite get a leg... Up. Hello? Pigeons? Friends now? Are we friends with the pigeons? Viz! Yo, Viz! Thanks for the raid. How you doing? Um. Whoop. We're playing Grand Fandango! Doing okay. Glad to hear it. We're playing Grand Fandango. We're approaching the end of the game. Hope you're doing good. I can get y'all caught it's up. cracked, but still stronger than me. I think using that old gargle as a structural support for Glamour Girl here was a bad idea. Mm. I can't stand all these points. We got the bad, bad ending on Sound Hill. Hell yeah. Nicely done. Um, I bet I could get over to the other roof on the leg of this sign, but the leg's pointed too far down, and it looks like Hector blew the motor. Hmm. He's got a good little jump. He's gonna... Yeah. There you go. That was Corvo Watermelon that damn good. I don't know. Love our little cook, right? Uh, so we have... Liquid nitrogen. Liquid nitrogen. Used on bone. It's a bone chipper. We have a bone now. chipper. We have a gun. Got that. We got our scythe. Can I use my scythe? Yeah, he's got the stilts on. I don't want to mess up my blade. He never wants to mess up his blade. God damn it. Here we go. Look, steady. Yeah. My scythe. My scythe. My scythe. My scythe. My 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 a little bit of this in there. Sproutella, not spackle. Okay, well. I think using that old gargle as a right. structural support for Glamour Girl here um, was a bad idea. Maybe, maybe we shoot it. I'm saving my ammo for the big guy. Okay, then what if we bone chip it up? Get that. Yeah. Well, so much for my third arm. Well, it's gone now. Oh, but now there's bone in there. Extra bone. We can um put that in there. That'll do it. Oh god. Oh god. Oh, oh god. Oh. Well, it was gonna happen eventually. Yeah, right. I Chihuahua! They're the real deal. Nice. That one must be yours. 
Don't forget to send for help. Mm-hmm. It's done. How'd you get it? We were supposed to have coverage back there. Where are all of Salvador's men? I don't know. He hasn't told me yet. What? Hola, Manuel. <laughs> Time for you to swing, daddy -o. Let's mm. see you mm. walk. Mm. All right. Okay. He's fine. <laughs> so okay. That's a double cross. These flowers? All people Hector has sprouted? Hey, when you're on top like my boyfriend Hector is, you make a lot of enemies. Gross. That's gross and what? weird, Olivia. You know, you really have bad taste in men. No, I have a taste for really bad men. There's a difference. Fuck. I thought I told you to scat, man. All right. You got... That's... No, that's not... Um, Olivia was the one running the blue casket. The place full of beatniks who were like, man, capitalism. And here she is working with the, the head honcho guy. Do I got anything in my my pockets? They didn't take my stuff. Oh, they took my scythe. So I got a bone chipper that's out of bone and liquid nitrogen. Great, we're dead. It's a handheld grinder. Did somebody say capitalism? Hi, Gam. No gun, no nothing. Well, maybe I should save. Uh, eh, eh. Do we have the whole thing filled up now? Oh, we almost did. Oh, the last little bit. Right at the end. Look at that mural. That must be the same mural as I was on the wall of the train station. Looks good. Uh, we're going to be fine. Just fine. Um, This must be Hector's murderous mausoleum. Mm. She loves me. She loves me not. By the way, chat bar I updated again. Well, you're half right. Oh, Manny, so cynical. What happened to you, Manny, that caused you to lose your sense of hope, your love of life? I died. I see. <laughs> I guess Domino is right. You don't have a shred of optimism. Hmm. Well, when it comes to shreds, Dom is the expert. Boom. And by that same logic, Manny. No real reason, you're about Delta. To become an expert in botany. Is this where you tell me all about your secret plan, Hector? How you stole double end tickets from innocent souls, pretended to sell them, but really hoarded them all for yourself in a desperate attempt to get out of the land of the dead? No. <laughs> this is where you writhe around in excruciating pain for about an hour because that idiot Bowsley ran off with all their fast acting Sproutella. No slow stuff will sprout you, but it's going to take a long time, I'm sorry to say. Well, damn. <laughs> Manny! Where are you going? You've got some time, you know, before you have to leave. <laughs> Get it? Leave. <laughs> now it's not a time for puns. I'm dying slowly. Well, good game. But I guess we're just dying. Oh. How we doing? Green. Spreading. So painful. I claw it out, but I don't have the strength. Nice approach. Thank you. I was gone for two seconds. Yeah, we're dying. So. I claw it out, but I don't have the strength. Mm -hmm. ah. Green. Spreading. So painful hmm mm-hmm mm-hmm well I know put put this on there too weak 
to grind. <laughs> Me when I don't get the high score in Tony Hawk. Uh, too weak to grind. All right. <laughs> oh shit. There you go. Good as new. Gracias. Toto Santos. Nice. <laughs> First three notes to swim, it's in C minor. Here I am. Come on, Get shake older it for me, all the One time. Of you must be mine. <sighs> no, those are for you, Olivia. Capiche? I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Oh, shit. Hey, how you doing, bud? He truly gave his body to the cause. Manuel, listen carefully. There's a gun in the trunk of this car, but the trunk key is with my body somewhere in the meadow behind the greenhouse. Find it! Right. And tell Leva that I know she will guide the Alliance wisely when I am gone. But when I bite this explosive tooth, the deadly cloud will sprout not just my target, but me as well. Your target? What are you- Hey, get out of there. Farewell, my friend. Salvador, no! What were you talking about with the head of the LSA in there? Oh, I get it. Because he's a head. Huh, Sal? Got something you want to share with the class? Only this. Viva la revolucion! He truly gave his body to the cause. Salvador. He's fine right where he is. Am I too weak to grind now? Yeah, I can grind again. Here I am. I get older all the time. I get older all the time. Do you want to grind with me, Salvador? One last time. Shit. Alright. Well, um, can't open the trunk. We need the key. It's locked. The key's with his body. I hope the LSA got a good deal on this car. What she says behind the greenhouse? Nothing like the real McCoy. Hey, my scythe. Nice. Oh. Well, what do you know? Sal had a ticket all along. Sal. Figures. Doesn't seem to be one for me. No, oh, Manny. Nothing like the real McCoy. Yoink. It's amazing how Salvador's ticket is still drawn to him. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Well, he's dead. Back to grinding, right? Oh, nice. I'm not doing anything now. Mm. My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Yeah. Full Grim Reaper mode. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't need it, though. I got a golden ticket. Mice, 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 mice. Well, I guess Olivia's just dead. So we need to find Sal's body to find the key for the gun, for the trunk for the gun. So then we can shoot Hector. Mice, 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 mice. Pop, 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 pop. Maybe we just walk back in. Oh, yep, yeah, yep. I'm not going in there until I'm packing some chlorophyll. Oh, yeah, I'll do it. This must be Hector's murderous mausoleum. Oh, he's in there. I'm not going in there until I'm packing some chlorophyll. Oh boy. Well, this must. Be Where's her gun? Yeah, we could have just gotten her gun. Seems to be attracted to something over this way. Hmm. This way. This. This way. What? Hello? Where'd it go? This way? What? This way? It... Thanks for the hydrate. Oh! What? <laughs> Did he just let go of it? It just gets blown away. There you go. Love that shot. Oh, Sal. 
He gave his head and his body to the cause. Loteria. All right, well, that's not the response I expected. Loteria. Sight to clear plants will never catch on, right? Did we get it? This must be the key to Salvador's trunk. All right. This must be the... It only works on Salvador's trunk, I'll bet. Mm-hmm. Loteria. Now we get the gun. And we just run back down this hill for an hour. Good thing Hector doesn't like to look outside. I think he'd be more interested in watching our slow, excruciating death, but... He's too busy. I saw someone using a scythe to mow their lawn once. That's intense. Yeah, a lottery. Like jackpot. Alright, give me that little key. And... Yeah. Ah, yes. Lots of ammo. There we go. Hey, hey. Please, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. <laughs> My gun doesn't need reloading yet. Yet. Freeze, Hector. We're going full yeah, Doom mode now? You heard me. Like uh, E1M1, but it's played by a big band. I miss Cell 2. Also, I haven't seen Glottis in like five minutes, so I miss Glottis. I miss everybody. So, yeah, he seems so happy. <laughs> He's got a good run cycle. Remember, this is their first fully 3D game, and like, there's a lot they got right, even if his legs are just kind of, you know. You know, it's fine. He's fine. Oh, then we can look at original gra- Oh my god, it's like a whole new game. The original graphics. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Um. If you're fast enough, Big Band Super can play Cruel Angel's Thesis. Oh. Freeze, Hector. Can yeah, I you heard me. The cloak makes him look taller. Um, he's wearing stilts under the cloak. It's in the first cutscene in the game. I'm not getting any closer until he runs out of ammo. If he runs out of ammo, that is. Mm-hmm. Welcome to the red button switch. Right? Yeah, we can bop him from here. There he is. Oh. And get him. Shit. Olivia, who's out there? I'm the Grim Reaper, lard ass, and you're my next customer. Shouldn't you be a patch of posies by now? Oh shit. Get him. My aim sucks. Me. He's quick. Yeah, get him. Is that your best? No. Where's the where's the first push person button? Shit. People who live in glass houses get pretty good at ducking, I see. Is that your best? Stop it. I'll break every Come one of these glasses. On, shorty. Yeah. Every window, every nice pane. Try. Thank you. There's no puzzle, you just have to murder him. Come on. Get him. Closer. The puzzle is how you murder him the best. Come on. <laughs> Shit. Shit. You can't escape the Grim Reaper, Hector, especially not when he's got a gun. <laughs> You're on a downhill disadvantage, Manny. I've got ammo in here for five years. Did he just say I have the high ground, but with more words? I have a downhill disadvantage? <laughs> this game really was Come by LucasArts. Shit. Shit. Fuck. Anakin, you have a downhill disadvantage. Don't try it. <laughs> Is that your Best. I don't know if that matters with bullets as much. Not from this range. Shit. Oh -ho! You underestimate ah! my Glock. <laughs> yeah, he's got ammo for five years, and we're not going in there until he runs out of ammo, so, um... Anyone got any ideas? I actually remember what you're supposed to do, but I'm curious if anyone that hasn't played this no, has an idea. I'm curious. This is the final puzzle in the game. Reload. My gun doesn't need reloading yet. No, it's got a lot of bolts in there. Uh, mice? Maybe it's mice time. Shoot better. Alt F4. The grinder, obviously. Mice. 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 Pizza delivery? Mice. Ticket? Mice. 
Mice. There's mice. plants in the house. Mice. There sure mice. are. Mice. Reap the mice. plants. I can't get mice. in there. Mice. 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 There's it. We've mice. seen what he needs mice. to interact with. That's mice. true. Mice. Mice. Maybe if mice. we just keep talking about mice, Hector will get confused and die of old age. He's a better ducker than I would have imagined. That's true. Mice. 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 Blind him with a ticket. The ticket only flies to someone who has a ticket. And that ticket we used was Salvador's ticket, which only fly to Sal. Um, is Scythe using the puzzle at all? Nope. Nope, the answer is gun. Do you shut off the power or something? Yeah, we can, we can do a loop around, a little loop around. Um, is this whole thing? Hmm. He's a better... He's a good ducker. I'm not getting any closer until he runs out of ammo. He collapsed the ceiling? Ammo, that is. No. Can't really get over there. Shoot out the dome. That would be fucking badass, though. Nitrogen in the pump? That would freeze him. That's kind of neat. Let's see if I can look at this. Become Splinter Cell. Night Division goggles. Hmm. Hector supplies water to keep the flowers alive? Does he see them as a memorial or as trophies? Not thirsty. So this is a water tank. Shoot the sky. Go get Gladys, he'll get him. Build the irrigation with flower juice. Why don't we try to use the... It's all gone. Oh, we're all out. It's all gone. Use everything on everything, as is the way. And time. Freeze, Hector. Wait, I mean, and yeah, and right. time. There you go. Apply gun. Actually, that's not time. I think you have to go to the door. That doesn't sound good. That doesn't sound mice. All right. That's a puzzle, right? No, he's okay. God, the music here is so good, too. I love the framing of all these shots and everything. Man, it's good. Anyway, uh, time. Get him. Get him, man. So what happened to him? Uh, we filled that place with, with gas that is deadly to bones and turns them into plants. Yeah, just toss the gun and walk away. So cool. If you don't talk to them, if Chapito's still walking around in circles, you can count then. them if you want. They're all here. How about yours? The company gave me one on the other end, sort of a retirement present. And uh, nice. the demon's right free, right? Aw, oh, man, you know I can't go with you. I'm a spirit of the land and all that. I can't ever leave this world. I guess I got so wrapped up in saving people, I just assume I'd be able to save you too. Yeah, but I don't need to be saved. I like it here. I'm not all alone in that basement anymore, thanks to you. I got a new job and all these new friends. I'm a big demon success story. So, I guess this is it then. Come here, give me a hug. Gladys. <laughs> you were the best boss I ever had. Bye. <laughs> How dare you, Oaf? How dare you? Manny? Yeah? When we get to the next world... What is it, Angel? Are we going to be together? You know, sweetheart, if there's one thing I've learned, it's this. Nobody knows what's gonna happen at the end of the line. You might as well enjoy the trip. A 
and then they rubbed teeth. <laughs> That's the game! The mariachis aren't allowed to go- nope. Mari mariachis are legal. Yeah, they, they, they go to kiss and it's just like... Just clacking noises. We solved the puzzle! Ah, uh, what a game. They're also spirits of the land. Don't you know anything about the protect? I oh, they follow him around. It does a bit. What well, Indiana Jones itself was kind of harkening back to like the same era of music. Murder's the greatest puzzle of all. We finishing it today? Yeah, we're gonna get around to finishing it. Thirty seconds ago. Everyone were condemned many in the first place. Nope. But if you're interested. I don't know. I don't think there's anything about that in there. I don't think it was ever intended to be explained. But um, I mentioned in the last stream of this that there is a Grim Fandango design doc floating around the internet because Tim Schafer released it before he was then uh, it, uh, informed that he doesn't own it. I believe it's the property of Disney. Um, so they took it down, but it's still on the internet. There's no sequel, no. But the original game's design document, uh, which was from like two or so years before the game ended up releasing, uh, is on the internet and. Um, there's a lot of cut content in there, a lot of stuff left on the cutting room floor. And it's also just fascinating to read about, kind of, their idea of the puzzles. Um, and in fact, there's one thing that, that I will uh, show on stream once we're done with the credits real quick. Because uh, in looking it up and playing it again, I, I found... he When he posted it on, I think it was the Double Fine blog, uh, which itself is no longer up. Um, he was like, oh, here's a couple of thoughts about it. Uh, and one of them was, was very good. So I'll share that in one second. But... Is the game's moral you should eat the rich? Yep. He's inherently a bad guy. He's an adventure game main character, right? I have not played Stubbs the Zombie. I heard good things about it back in the day. The three key door concept used to split the game into sessions. There's some smart ideas in this game. I mean, obviously, it's like... I highly recommend people check it out, uh, and highly recommend people play it, but there's definitely... You know, th this was considered kind of the, the the death knell of the game, of, of, of the adventure game. Unfortunately, that's a little bit of its legacy. Because um, it was a very expensive game, took a long time to produce, and did not sell well, very famously. Even though it's a very good game. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, and, uh, yeah. It's, I'm glad they got the remastered version so a new generation can play it. But, yeah. But it's like, yeah, for as compelling as I find it to be, and I love the world and the characters, and there are some legitimately very clever puzzles in here. It's still kind of of its age, even though they were trying to modernize the control scheme. There wasn't a lot of modernization of the thought processes. There's a lot of parts of the game that are designed around the idea that if you get stuck, you just put it down and do something else for a couple days, uh, which is not how games are really designed anymore. Um, so... This goes tricking Leighton have been maps class. Thank you. Yeah, at some point we'll do the Leighton prequels. We'll do that soon. Appreciate it, y'all, man. Yeah. It covers stream by this talent. Yeah, well, the, yeah. Yeah. It's also my understanding is that um, they made Full Throttle before this, and that being a success gave them permission from the higher ups to make Grim Fandango, which then became like the last adventure game LucasArts made. And then Tim Schafer ended up making his own company. And making Psychonauts and all that stuff at Double Fine. So, hi, dear. Was that two, a two QA people? Possibly. It's very possible. Which, th and then they worked on the re- yeah. It's full circle. I'm doing good. Yeah, there's actually a, um, a documentary about the making of the, the remastered edition. Getting into how- I think they had to find physical tapes in the Disney vault with original assets on them for some of the, the up-resed assets and stuff. I played the demo of it, Trediosity, and I really liked it. I've been meaning to check it out. I don't know if I'll stream it or not. Hey, Shiv, perfect timing. Welcome. Yeah, I've heard, uh, uh the, I really like the demo of Case of the Gold Knight. It scratches the, uh, um, whatchamacallit, Oberdin, Return of the Oberdin itch. Harvestella, mm-hmm. That was corporate boogeyman. No, I think there are literal warehouses filled with just random shit. Um, it's it's been a long time since I watched the documentary. Also, this game, the remastered version, has developer commentary. 
which obviously I didn't play with it on, but if you play through it again on your own, you can check it out. Thanks, George. We love you, George. I want to work in the Disney vault. That sounds like a nightmare. <laughs> like legit. Just a hundred years of bullshit just piling up. What's he got to say? I don't know. A lot of me is just sitting in a vault somewhere. Yep. Because games like this were made with tons of stuff just on physical media lying around. Ugh. It's just filled with mouse fists. Super haunted. Angry Clown is my favorite character. Yeah. Again, the, the, uh, the design doc has a lot of characters left on the cutting room floor. Which is fascinating. Oh, I'm being Lupa. Yeah, I'm bummed you don't- it, when you return to Rubicava. I mean, it's meant to be short so it doesn't kill the pacing. Um, it's really neat that you kind of work your way back to El Maro. Um, it would be nice to go back to the, uh, Calavera Casino and maybe see Lupe and see how the place has changed under new management, but it makes sense. And for pacing reasons and for budget reasons, for a lot of reasons, it makes sense to not go back. Also, the voice cast is so good. It holds up so well. The, like, if the recordings were not a little bit crunchy, you'd think it was recorded today. It's, it's such high quality. Full Throttle one. I've never been the biggest fan of Full Throttle. So I don't know if I'll stream it or not. I did play the remaster a couple years ago. It's a much shorter game from what I remember. That would probably be a, a, a one stream deal. It's not recorded VA. Amazing. Yeah, right? It's all performed live every time you start the game. Tiny Hammer for Slay. Yeah, I don't know. It's good. Didn't Lupe get arrested? I don't know if she got arrested. I mean, the oh, the, the, the casino did get shut down. That is true. I'm sure Lupe's fine. It's over. It's over. Yeah, the soundtrack's amazing. If she got arrested, it's not her fault. Mm -mm. Lupe is pure. She should have been on the train at the end, man. What's up? No, there you go. Done. Dear, thanks for 55 months. That's a lot of months. Even though I've been aware for a long time. It is the adventure game released by LucasArts before this that was um, helmed by Tim Schafer. Um, it's, it's more about, like, biker gang culture. And also has, like, an anti-capitalist message on top. It's kind of a theme, huh? Um, Maze VA was the dad and ugly Betty as well. Who wins the death bureaucracy that could give me a ticket? Yeah, they kind of gloss over that, because it's sort of implied that, like, Dom... Or no, Don Copal is Manny's boss, and then he's answering to Hector. You don't get a sense that there's another larger organization involved, but there must be? Clearly, to be like, oh, thanks for helping. You know, we thought everything was fine, us higher ups, but you solved the mystery, so now here's a ticket. Also, they can just do that. I don't know. It seems. I'm glad it gets a happy ending, regardless. <laughs> like, if if it was Manny, but I, I guess it doesn't really matter because it's like, <laughs> yeah, do what, whatever. It's like it's like if he couldn't be on the number nine train at the end, they would have just like waited for him at the station, right? So it's fine. I've not played Loam. I just took Salas. You can't use someone else's. It's illegal. Um, anyway. Yeah. Uh, let me, uh, uh, so one quick thing I wanted to show from the dock. Uh, is literally the last thing in here. Um, don't worry about that. Um, also, uh, actually. Wow. Hold on. It's just gonna play the opening cutscene. Um, stop. Hmm. Yeah, I know. He, look, he's back. Um, I think it's in here. Yeah, there's there's a, a concept art gallery, and it's like 98 pages of just like... I'm not normally one to look at concept art when it's in a, a game. It's not really a thing anymore. It used to be much more common. You, you would unlock concept art, but it's like stunning. It's Every page of this is stunning. I highly recommend it. Anyway, um, uh, but, uh, but, 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 but real quick... Um, so this is the, the design document I've been talking about. Um, 96, the game came out in 98, I believe. So a lot of stuff is different. So it's like year one, here's the structure of the puzzles. Here's the locations. This was like their pitch document, either to higher ups or to the team. I'm not really sure. Um, breaking down some of the plot, whatever. It's like 70 goddamn pages. At the very end though, um, restaurant standoff, uh, get the bone, stop the bone wagon, train station, Olivia's secret, Sprout Hector, um, so this is the very end here. Uh, Olivia's become Hector Lonzo's girlfriend, etc. 
Uh, Hector leads Manny back to the car to get the suitcase, but it's missing. Someone's walked off with it with who? Hector thinks Manny knows. He forces him to march through a sunflower patch with him to find it. Manny gets loose. Hector curses and starts hunting him down. The solution! And it's just a bunch of gibberish. Um, and then that's like... And then the game ends. <laughs> and you're like, uh, what? And then when when Tim Schafer posted this, he was like, oh, fun fact. I, I couldn't think of a solution to how the game would end. So I just made it look like a printer error and assumed no one would read 72 pages and we would figure it out later. And that's exactly what happened. So that's an intentional error. And it's like he said, it's just like, it's just nonsense. Two paragraphs overlapped. It's like, that's, that's kind of amazing. <laughs> so I wanted to share that on stream. But again, if you just Google Grim Fandango design document, puzzle document, whatever, um, you'll you'll be able to find this just fine. I recommend it. It's neat. And now that you've seen the full game, you don't have to worry about spoilers. And you can just enjoy everything on its own merits and not worry about what's going on. But yeah, it's neat. Yeah, there's this there's this draft character that was cut. I don't know. Lots of stuff. Anyway. Um, yeah, that's it. Uh, Viz, thanks again for the raid. Public key reveal party. Thanks for seven months. My key is, of course, three. Deer with 55 months. Fluffy, four months. At least I, at least I can resub. See y'all in VOD later. Thank you. Track Rock 100 bits. For years I've heard praise for Grim Go without ever hearing about Gladys. Bayo3 has introduced me to some real neat monsters. If I could use my hair to summon a demon, I'd be listening to Vroom Vroom in a cool car. Thanks for the playthrough. Yeah, Gladys is excellent. He doesn't get the, uh, I don't know. I think he gets a good amount of attention. But if you've seen anything from Grim Fandango, it's just Manny in a suit. Which makes sense. Gamer DLM, thanks for 56 months and the prime. I appreciate it. Um, that's it for me. Gladys is the best character, god damn it. And I I it's internally consistent that he has to stay behind. And it's so bittersweet, but it's so good. It wouldn't make sense if it's like, yeah, come with us. You know? Like it, it it's it's thought out. I like that. I like that. Um What the hell? What are you doing, Yeti? I'm over here looking for someone to raid. How dare you? The heck you doing? Um, shit. Dan streaming Sea of Thieves, and that sounds excellent. Um, we're gonna do that. Uh, Yeti, thank you so much for three gifted subs, because three is, of course, my stream key. Two emotional support vegetable cami jams and Cyrochrone. Hope you enjoy the emotes. Hope you enjoy uh, bar eh. I'll probably toss it on a beat. The problem is that I've, I made like five of those manis. Um, so I don't know. Um, by the way, I didn't. I don't think I shared the uh, the full resolution. Here's the the year four suit, and here he is in his yeah, in his, with his cloak. I thought about giving him a scythe, a scythe, but I kind of like him just shrugging. He's just a little. It's really fun to draw him. It's real fun. Anyway, uh. He's a little guy. I hope you enjoyed Grim Fandango. If it's your first time seeing the game, I hope you enjoyed it. If I got to help you revisit it, I hope you enjoyed it as well. Um, Sircon, thank you so much. Pleasure watching you. Thank you. I, it's a great game. Um, it's available on like everything. So if you want to check it out for yourself or give it to a friend or something, just again, maybe be like, you know, just look up a hint guide. Not a full walkthrough, not a step-by-step -step walkthrough because you still got to stumble around probably experience um yeah mice is a good raid message mice with the with the shrug if you got it and if not just say mice <laughs> thanks so much i'll be back for a short stream on sunday before indie land get get the hell out of here goodbye see you later hey vod watchers i hope you enjoyed grim fandango remastered um show me those original graphics bam oh man Time for a second playthrough with original graphics and tank controls. Let's go. Let's let's fucking go. Here we go. All right. Oh god. Oh god. Oh. Oh my god. He takes so long to turn though. Like I can play with tank controls just fine, but that turn speed. Holy shit. Gamers in '98 were suffering. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. I feel like for some places it would make it easier though when there's like a bunch of stuff you can interact with next to each other to select what you're doing, but... Oh, man. Anyway, take care. Links in the description of the game or, or, or something. I don't know. Goodbye. I'm just gonna... Manny's just gonna moonwalk out of here, right, Manny? See you later. He's off screen, right? You can't see him anymore? Okay, good.